Is that working? It's working. Hello, everybody. Hello. Merry, well, happy holidays. And for those of you who celebrate Christmas, Merry Christmas Eve Eve. Look at my, look at my shirt. Oh, oh, oh. Snoopy. It's Snoopy. Ice skating. I think he's ice skating. No, he's not. He's pulling a sled. Look, Woodstock's there too. Can you see him? Cute. Hello, everybody. Also, I'm Gyu. Go enjoy your concert. Thank you for saying hi, but you should go enjoy your concert. <laughs> this is not nearly as exciting. But hello. Poor Poncho. Hi, I'm new. Amgu, you said hydrate. I don't have water, but guess what I do have? I bought, I got boba. Boba! Let me, I hate stabbing the lids. Ready? Wait. Ready? Can you see it? No. I'm scared. Oh, okay. I did it. I did it. I can't hear anything. This is Thai tea boba. I like the Thai tea. I tried it one time because my cousin told me to do, do so. And it's really good. But I've never had this boba place before, so let's see. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's good. Boba's good as good as good as good. But hello, everybody. It's so good to see you. Sorry I'm late. I'm still not feeling like super 100%. So I was resting all day and then I was like, oh, shoot. It's really late. <laughs> and I totally forgot what um what time it was or I didn't notice. And I was like, um, you're supposed to be streaming. Good job, buddy. Good job. So we're here now. It's so good to see all of you. Thank you. I just saw your message. The explosions and fire are my favorite part. That does sound very good. I know they can't hear me. Who am I talking to? Sorry. A weird smell. It just filled my nose. And I was like, what is that? What is that? What? Oh, wait. Oh, Thai tea. I've never had that before. It's really good. It's really good. I'm usually a matcha tea kind of gal, but this is pretty good. Also, Joe, how are you doing? If you can hear me, I heard that you're sick. Is that true? Are you also not feeling very well? If so, I'm so sorry. We just had, so the lead teacher I work with, guys, tested positive for COVID on Wednesday night, I think it was. Yes, I think so. So then on Thursday, everybody was a little nervous. I took a, I took a COVID test. I was negative. But then again, sometimes you do it too early. So let's hope that wasn't the case. And then my other TA was out on Thursday because she wasn't feeling well. And then co come to find out on Friday that she tested positive for COVID. The other lead teacher in kindergarten, I mean, in first grade tested positive for COVID. And then, so then that was three people who all tested for COVID who I had been in close proximity with. So I was like, well, that's not good. Um, but I don't think I have COVID. I think I'm just, honestly, I feel like I'm not like super sick. I think I was just like slightly sick, but then I was just super run down from like having to really pick up like, and you know, not the slack, but like pick up more tasks and like things to do because people were gone. You know what I mean? Oh, Joe, you feel like crap. Is it a cold, Joe? Do you think it's a cold? Never had horchata. I've heard it's very good, though. I think I've had horchata. I think it's really good, but what did I have horchata? Like, I feel like I had horchata once, but it was something very specific. I feel like it was something very specific. I don't know what it was, so maybe I'm lying, but I feel like I have had it before. <laughs> I just can't remember, but I, I do know that it's it's very, isn't it very sweet? It has to be. I feel like they sell a lot of horchata like right next to my house too because there's kind of like a little like market over there with all those types of treats and sweets, all that jazz. Um, but thank you guys for being so kind to me this week when I was sick and not feeling well. Um, I'm so glad that we could do kind of a stream today. I said that I was hoping it would be a longer stream, but we'll see kind of how things go and if I'm feeling good because I like I said, I, my head just kind of hurts and I feel a little like swimmy. So we'll just see how things go and we're going to vibe and have a good Christmas Eve Eve slash holiday time, you know? So I hope your guys' holidays have been really good and you have something exciting for the rest of the, the time. Tomorrow is my anniversary with Tim the Milkman. Um, 
and apparently we're going out to dinner to like a really nice restaurant. So we'll see how that goes. Hi, sexiness. Merry Christmas Eve Eve. Um, sexiness, I have some messages for you from my brother that I need to share because he gave some advice back about your image and your font. So I'll send those over to you. I am feeling better, Propel. Thank you. Also, it's so good to see you. Hello. Hi, no need. Wow. Why do I always get just too excited and then mess up, mess up your name? Hi, Nino Keto. How are you? Welcome in. How's it going? Rice, milk, and cinnamon. That's horchata. Maybe I have it. Well, I think I have had it, but I, I feel like it wasn't actually like horchata. It was just like a horchata flavoring induced in something. The sexiness. Don't say uh-oh. He just, he's very helpful. He's very helpful. He did say though, and I didn't notice, he did say that wiz wizardry is, is not spelled correctly on your image. I'll, I knew that part I saw. Merry Christmas Eve Eve, Nino Keto. What time is it where you are? It's 7.30 here. So I don't know. I don't know. I have cold or flu, probably negative for COVID. Well, good, Joe. Joe, are you doing anything for the next two days? Like, are you going to see family? Or what are you doing? Like having a teacher talk to me after class? No, sexiness, not that at all. Lame? What do you mean, Poncho? Lame? Like, not the same? Are you disappointed in me? Rum chata, maybe? Maybe, Sarah. Maybe. Also, hello, welcome in. Rice milk, rice milk, or rice milk? That's a good question. I have no idea. It's 4.30 p.m. on the 24th. Oh, my goodness. Whoa. Yeah, you're very close to Santa time. That's for sure. Where do you... Do you mind me asking where you live? Don't tell me if you don't want to tell me. You can tell me general region even. Because you're way past where I am. You're almost like a whole day ahead of me. Oh, New Zealand. Okay. I feel like that. Okay. I get it. I got it now. I get it. Got it good. Depends how I feel. Probably not doing anything tomorrow. Well, that's probably a good idea, Joe. Did you like my gift, Joe, that I sent you? I feel like that was easier than actually sending you a gift. I hope you like it. Hi, Sarah. I'm trying to emulate your emoji. It's very interesting that the emotes, even my emote kind of does this. I guess if I'm waving to somebody from far away, that makes sense. But if I'm waving, never mind. Okay, I'm going to stop. <laughs> it's Christmas Eve here as well. Oh my gosh, Propel, what time is it where you are right now? I have boba. Well, life is good with boba in my hand. Mm. Mm. Oh, 11.30 a.m. Hmm. Dragon, enjoy the nutcracker. That's awesome. I know you and I kind of live in the same neck of the woods. And I saw... I'm chewing boba. I'm so sorry. I saw the posters for that, so enjoy. I wanted to see it. But I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you again another time. But thank you, thank you. Boba flavor, it's Thai tea boba. Thai milk tea boba. It's my new fave. I didn't think I'd like it, but then my cousin was like, no, try it. And I tried it, and I'm like, that is amazing. It's amazing. It is very good. It kind of looks, the first time I saw her have it, I was like, it looks like clay, like clay water. <laughs> and I was like, I don't know if I'd be into that. It's really good, though. It's super good. Nice and um, sweet. Normally, I'm, I am I get like matcha tea because I love matcha tea. Hi, Izzy V. Enjoy your quiet and lurk. So good to see you. But it is delicious. It's very delicious. I was sitting here right before stream, and that's why I also was a little late because I was like, I want my boba to get here before I hit go live so I can grab it and then sit down. But I was like, do I want boba? And I was like, well, it's Christmas Eve Eve. Who knows if anybody's doing boba, like doing DoorDash. And I was like, but I want boba. And the place next to my house was closed, so I was like, I'm going to lurk and see, lurk in the shadows and see if anybody's delivering boba. And they were. So life is good. Life is grand. I got the whole wide world in the palm of my hand. What? Oh, my phone was like, Twitch. I'm like, what about Twitch? It says, Malsy B is live. As if. Okay. <laughs> All right, let me, let me shut up <laughs> and switch over to just dead um I wanted to do breath of the wild but my switch was dead and I was like wow way to prepare way to be good at life um you know oh my god that was really loud in my ears <laughs> that just literally scared the crap out of me okay <clears throat> I'm fine everything's fine let me just get my life together really fast or in general Hopefully this loads. I did just add a few more mods, I feel like. <gasps> For shame. Enjoy my pretty background. 
for shame. I jinxed it. Redo. Well, I guess we'll all just talk. <laughs> just kidding. Do you guys want to see, though, what my best friend sent me for Christmas? I just got it last night. It's a Bakugo. <laughs> it's a Bakugo. Look at him. He's flying. He's ready. So if you didn't know, my brother sent me, or he gifted me, this one for my birth for my birthday, for Christmas. Joe, oh, Joe, you didn't. He's in the chat. It's Deku. He's sitting. He's cute. He's ready. He's chilling. Um, and then for my birthday, okay, it's loading again. For my birthday last year? Yeah, last year, my friend James gave me this Bakugo. I like how I just have them all right here. So we have this Bakugo. I'm so cool. And now we have this Bakugo. Oh, look at them, like, ready to fight. Okay. But we have the sleeveless Bakugo. Pretty cool. I love Bakugo. He's my fave. So <laughs> my friend James was like, enjoy them. Now you have two. And I was like, I got to collect them all. I'm going to buy every single form of Bakugo, I guess. Um, I really want to get a Dobby figurine, though. I really want one. I also want a Todoroki figurine real bad. So we'll see. We'll see if that happens for me. All right. Load it again. Let's see if it got its life together. Let's see if I have my life together. Here. We'll switch. Here we are. We're back again. Here we are. It'll go dark. That's pretty cool. Thanks. <laughs> I like how Propel was like, that's pretty cool. And then Pachi was like, that's super cool. Thanks, Pachi. All right. Loading. Loading. I know the Smappy mod curse, though, Nino Kido. For real. For real. Sometimes it doesn't. We've been very lucky, I feel like, lately, and it's been okay. But tonight it was just like, you know what? Merry Christmas. <laughs> I haven't played that game in months. Patchy, you should play. You should play. It's pretty amazing. All right, let's see. Let's see if it works this time. If not, if not, I don't know. We'll try again, I guess. I saw somebody, um, Sunflower Hubble, playing on... Pack it? Unpack it? Is that what it's called? Or unpacked? It worked. See, sexiness, we just needed you to come in and say something. Um, they played unpacking? Unpacking! I saw them live the other day playing unpacking, but I was dying in bed, so I didn't jump in. But, um, I was so jealous. I was like, I love that game so much. So it went in doubt. If stream ever just hates us, we'll just play unpacking. <laughs> I saw it was coming and it surrendered. Exactly. It saw I was coming. Sorry. Exactly, sexiness. It was like, uh-oh. It's like, I was going to say my master. I feel like you're like a master at this point. Right? Right? I don't know. Sometimes Smappy just hates me. And it's fine. It's perfectly fine. I get it. I really push it to its limits, you know? And as we all do, I feel like in some ways. Hi, Sue. Welcome in. How are you? That was adorable. OMG, Molly. OMG, Sue. How are you? Okay, wait. I have too much. <gasps> too much. Let's get rid of these. Now you can be in there. Bye, family. Love you. What do I have? Ko Kozu 5 is predicted rain all day tomorrow, and they're never wrong. Oh, I had a rainy day gear mod and it finally came through. Oh, Sandy finally gave us the Tom Kai soup. Love that. Because we're at seven hearts with her. Swell. Swell. What am I doing? Okay. We can bring Linus a tuna. I think I have one somewhere. Always push starter to its limits. That sounds evil, sexiness. Never. I'm great. How are you? I'm doing well, Sue. Still a little under the weather, but we're here. We're here and we're doing some Stardew, so I can't complain, you know? But I'm so happy to hear that you're doing great. That's all I can ask for. Oh, okay. Oh my god, why do I have so many animals in here? And the best thing is, is dragons watching the Nutcracker, so they can't make me sell any of them. Remember when they said they were going to make me get rid of Littlefoot? I'm going to jinx myself. I just jinxed myself. They're going to like somehow finagle this. Or I'm going to have to sell Littlefoot tonight. I'm, I'll cry. This all looks so much fancier than usual. Does it? Oh, well, Patchy, I do have mods. Um, 
So it might, might look a little different than um, normal vanilla Stardew. I have mods on that are definitely very like aesthetic mods, which reminds me, College, who we all know and love, told me I needed to get this one mod that's like way back Pelican Town or something like that. I think that's what it's called. Um, what am I, is this a rock? Oh, it is a rock, okay. And it made all the buildings in town like beautiful. They all look so gorgeous. So I need to show you all. I mean, if you know the mod, then you won't be impressed, but I like nearly screamed when I got on to play one day on like just a random new account I made. Cause I was like, yeah, I'll check it out. It's beautiful, guys. Stay psych right now. This is super loud in my ears. Let me know if it's too loud for anybody else. The summer music like is beautiful, but it bops. It bumps. Always. Okay. Anything else? I got too much stuff in my pockets. These are growing. I think Saturday is the day that we realize they get done. Oh, fruit. Fruit. I like how our Stardew to-do to list still just says, make Sandy and Penny like me. Sounds a little desperate, but you know, that's okay. We're so close to 100% for friendships and I'm getting closer on money. But like I said, I just need the ancient fruit to be kind and grow, grow, grow. I should probably plant more in on the island, but it's a lot of work. It's just so much work. All right, I'm out. And then one last place to check. Nothing, goodbye. Nothing, nothing, nothing. My cat. Hi, buddy. I don't know where the real life Murphy is right now. I haven't seen her in a while. Oh yeah, we put a bird on the, on the horse's head. What a cutie. What a cutie. All right, all right, chores. Chores. I know the drill. Oh, 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 do I? Okay. Um, oh, that's not milk. You know, that might be why it's not going in there. I was like, I'm confusion. Why is this not working? Ship. Do -do 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 -do. Um, what else? I need to make more kegs. I think I need wood though. Wood is now like the issue for me. I feel like before it was bars and I don't think it's as much of like the oak resin, but I think I'm slowly but surely, surely like using all of it. All right, what's my purpose now? Fish, tuna? No tuna? No tuna. Tuna. I remembered because I knew I needed it for recipes. Oh wait, come on Epona, it's not raining today, let's go. We're going together. Blech, got body chills. Ooh, Joe, body chills are the worst. Are you taking anything, Joe? Or like eating anything, drinking anything? What are you doing to help? No tuna? I know. Mmm. Mmm. Look. Look. Isn't this so pretty? I'm obsessed. Like, that balcony, are you kidding? And then if you come down here, gorgeous. Look, Pam's house is like, almost like a small little ranch home rather than like a trailer. Here's Lewis's house. Malsy's alive. Hi, Bogart. Welcome in. How are you? I missed you too. Good to see you. Good to see you. How you doing? I'm feeling better. I have a kind of a headache right now, but we're persevering. You know what I mean? <clears throat> so yeah, that's how it's going. I'm gonna take Muse next soon. Good, Joe. You should get some sleep. Get some good old fluids in you and sleep. Um, yeah. Look at the fabric though. 
Look how cute. Let's go explore this way. I'll show you the other buildings because it's amazing. I haven't seen the wizard's tower yet, I realized. I don't know if that looks different. Here's Leah's house. Gorgeous. There's Jazz. Marnie's is cool. It's very white, though. Very white. I think I'd like to see a little bit of difference, but it's all right. It's fine. We'll take what we can get. It looks so amazing. I love how the buildings look. I know. I know. I'm obsessed. Oh, look at the wizard's tower. You know, it kind of looks like Rapunzel's tower. That's what it reminds me of. Cute. If you don't know, I love Rapunzel and I love Tangled. <laughs> For Belle's like recorder solo right now. I haven't expanded my repertoire, Perpel. So we're gonna have to choose from my very limited repertoire. Is his hair in a ponytail? <gasps> it is. I love that for him. I love that. Hi, Victor. I was just thinking about you. How are you? I don't think I've ever seen this cutscene before. Have I? You caught me. It wasn't even looking in his direction. He's like, ah, you caught me. And I'll say I think every tower looks like Rapunzel's tower. That's fair. <laughs> That's fair in a way, right? How are you feeling, Molly? I'm feeling better. My, I was just saying, my head hurts, and my nose is a little, like, congested, and I have, like, a slight sore throat, but I'm doing much better than I was. I'm just super tired. I'm good, sore, but good. Victor, what were you doing? Why are you so sore? Were you working out? You're a villain, Molly. All right, I'll do it. I didn't say anything. I kind of missed what he said. I gotta remember that advice Molly gave me in the saloon. <laughs> I don't... Is he going to ask her out? I think I have seen this cutscene, actually. Emily? Sorry, Caroline. Could you excuse me for a minute? I wish it was from working out. What did you do, Victor? Look at Caroline. Caroline just walks away and looks at the flowers. Yes, Clint? I was wondering if you would go with, with me tomorrow. Gulp. That was not a gulping noise. I've got two tickets for the Grampleton Carnival in a few days. Well, would you go with me? She's like, yes, platonic friends. <laughs> sure, Clint, that sounds fun. Really? Okay, we can meet up in town and head over there together. Okay, see you soon then. She out. She out. And then there's me. Cody BB. Hi, Cody. Welcome in. I'm Molly. My pronouns are she, her, hers. If anybody else would like to share their pronouns, please do. The other day, my hip and back went snap, crackle, and pop, and I've been in pain since. Oh my god, Victor, that sounds absolutely awful. I'm so sorry to hear that. Oh god, I clicked on the other screen and then everything went bad. Everything went horrible. Hang on. <laughs> my Stardew hates me. Thank you for the follow, by the way, Cody. Welcome in. So glad to have you. She, they. Okay, thank you for sharing. But welcome in. How are you doing? So glad to have you here. Victor, were you doing something specific to make your back go crack, snap, crackle, pop? Or is it just life? Because I know how that goes. Feels like my tailbone top popped out of place. Ooh. Ah ho. You should go to the doctor. Just saying. Oh, I need to do this. We need to do the bone quest. Oh, look, the bridges are different too. I legit got out of bed. Oh no. I'm so sorry. Here's, look at Alex's little ice cream stand is different. Here's the museum slash library slash 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 Clint's. Pretty cool. Hi, I'm good. I just graduated, so I'm finally back into Stardew. <gasps> Cody, congratulations. That's amazing. Did you graduate high school? Did you graduate college? I mean, either way, that's pretty amazing. So congrats, congrats. I'm glad you're able to get back into Stardew now that you have some free time. That's super exciting. Okay. We have Stardew going, we're, we all love Stardew here. A bachelor's in engineering, holy hell, big brain. Congratulations, wow. That's insane proud of you. I know it doesn't mean anything, but I'm proud. <laughs> Engineering is no easy task. Let me tell you what. It's too cold to leave my house. Oh no. Why can't I move? There we go. 
It was negative 28 with a wind chill yesterday and 50 mile per hour wind. Oh my god, you sound like you live in Colorado. That's how it was in Colorado recently. There was like a 50 degree temperature drop. It was insane. I'm so sorry, Victor. Is it still gonna be cold the rest of the week? Everybody say Colorado. Are you making fun of the way I sell you Colorado? Eh, don't. I'm a giraffe. <laughs> I'm looking for Linus. Okay. It was a process. I like the little asterisk in its process. I feel that so hard. Oh my gosh. Well, still, you did it. And that's what matters. And now you have a degree that nobody can ever take away from you. You know what I mean? That's what my dad always says. He's like... Just graduate, because then you have a degree, and nobody can ever take that away from you, and all is well. Wait. I opened my Stardew with save after a year, and all my animals are mad, and I have no hay, nor any grass to get wheat. Oh, no. <laughs> can you go to Marnie's, or is it the wrong day, Patchy? Also, I'm so proud of you for getting on Stardew right now. So proud. Okay, wait. I got to do this skeleton thing. Skeletons are... I don't remember what floor they are in the mines. Let's see. Let's see. Mm -mm -mm. Let's put things away first. Shells. Crafting. And then let's go back here. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. An update on Breath of the Wild. They finished all the Divine Beasts. You finished all the Divine Beasts, Bogart? I hate you. One last tower. God, you're making me look like a chump. I, not that it's hard. You broke your braces, Sue. Oh, my God. Did you get hurt when you said it? I mean, when you said it, when you broke them? Ow, ow, ow. College and I are experiencing the same weather. Oh, okay. Oh, well, you guys, I feel so bad for you, Victor. Up in that neck of the woods, I guess that makes sense. Oof. Oof. Northern Wisconsin got you. It's like negative 45. Oh, my God. That's insane. I do not envy you. <laughs> I'll say it's like 45 degrees here. Maybe, actually, it might be warmer than that. I might be lying. I also got the hang of wind bombing. Dang, Bogart. I need to watch you play. Someday. Maybe you'll show me how, your uh, your skills so I know how to play. No one can take away your degree. Dictatorship government enters chat. <laughs> Sexiness, but why would they? Why would they? Give them a reason. Oh, holy shit. Congrats on the degree. I know, Bogart. Isn't that amazing? Show me the money. Hi, Plebo. Welcome in. Good to see you. How's it going? I hope it does show me the money because your girl's... Not poor, but she needs more money in this game. Just popped a bracket off. Ooh, I remember those days, and that does not feel good. Or when it breaks and it's, like, stabbing in your cheek because it's, like, not in all the way. Blech. Negative nine still, Sue? That's really cold. What levels are the skeletons on? Let me Google this. Let me Google. Stardew. Skeleton levels. I feel like I know, but I... Want to be sure. 71 through 79. Here we go. I can do anything now. I've beat everybody. Next Thursday, we're going to have a great wave, and it's supposed to be near 50. Oh, my gosh. What a difference. Holy moly. Well, that'll be nice, though. Not super great, now that you had to go through all this terrible weather to get there, but that's okay. At least it'll be better than negative 9. You know? Where are the skeletons blowing everything up? And including myself. Ooh, I made it out. Okay. I made it out. I made it out. Eight, 876K is more than I've ever made. Really, Flavo? Nah. Nah. You just gotta grind. You gotta grind. It's, it's okay. It's okay. I need more, though. I mean, if we're gonna try to get all these freaking obelisks obelisks. I feel like I always say that wrong. Then I need a lot of money. I need all the money. I think it's like technically because the clock is 10 million. Oh my god, the stairs are right here. <laughs> POV 20 with braces. My mom was 20 or so and she had braces. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that at all. You know? Oh gosh, us Californians don't know what cold is. I mean, I know what cold is, but you know what? I've been saying I really miss the cold, but I will say that the other day I was driving to work and I'm like, I'm so glad I don't have to clear snow off my car 
that I don't have to like freeze my butt off every morning as I'm like outside with the students for like morning recess and stuff. I mean, I'm still really cold because I'm always cold, except for right now I'm super hot. Um, <clears throat> but at least I'm not like frozen to the bone, you know what I mean? Dictatorships have critical thinking. Oh geez, Louise. <laughs> so they take away my degree. They don't want my they don't want my theater degree. What would they do with it? What would they do with it? I mean, I know that's not the point, but I'm I mean I'm not using it currently, so I guess I guess they could have it if they really want it. Maybe they could put it to better use. <laughs> ah Ah uh. Ow! That was rude. The audacity. How many pieces of bone do I have? Twelve? Twelve. Stupid bipolar Wisconsin weather for real. See, but that reminds me of Colorado because I looked it up earlier. I always creep on Colorado weather because that's where I'm from. And it, it was negative nine when I looked at it. And then the rest of the week now it's supposed to go back up to like the 50s. And I'm like, that was so random. Mm -mm -mm. Chewing. Oh, Sue, it makes yourself self-conscious, but when it's done, I'll be able to smile. You should be able to smile now. I'm sure your smile is still beautiful no matter what. But I get it. It'll feel nice once you get them off. And you won't feel that way anymore, you know? And you'll know that all of the pain was worth the gain of a beautiful smile. That was so gross. I'm so sorry. That was the stupidest thing that's ever come out of my mouth. <laughs> is it Neil... I want to say it's Neil Nail, but I don't think that's right. But welcome in. Thank you so much for the follow. Glad to have you here. You are having a great night. Okay. I know the stairs are here, but are there any other skeletons? Yes. You're hiding. Come here. Come. Two more bones. It's going to take me for freaking ever. At my area, the news says it's nine, but feels like negative eight. That is a wild difference. Holy moly. Had mine for three to four, I think. Oh my gosh. That's how long you had your braces? Almost eight years. See, I don't understand. How come people have to have braces for so long? Like, I, I know that there's like reasons, but I don't know what they are. Like, is it just cause like you have to reset so many different things in your mouth to make them work? Cause like they told my brother, Matt, that in order for his teeth to get straight, they'd have to break his jaw and reset it and then he'd have to do it all over again. And this is after he had braces for like two years. And my dad was like, yeah, no, we're not doing that. <laughs> we're not doing that at all. So, I don't know. I know some people have them for a very long time. How long have you been playing Stardew Valley? Um, do you mean in general or this save file? Cause I've been playing Stardew, oh my God, I don't even know, a long time. Years upon years. I guess I could look at like the date when I actually got the game somehow. So it's been a couple years. This save file we started in August. We started back in August. So <laughs> if you're looking at how long in general, years. If you're looking at this game, just a few months. I guess it'd be quite a few months now. Colder through the week for you, Patchy? Oh no. Look for bone fragments is at the dig site. Oh, that's true, Bogart. I just saw your message. You're so right. I should go over there. I'll do that tomorrow because it's already tw about 12 p.m. in the game. Depending upon how crooked your teeth and stuff are. Oh, okay, I had to have four teeth pulled to make room for my new teeth. Oof. No bueno. But Victor, I think I had to do something similar when I was younger. I had to get like four. I had to get like four or five teeth pulled, and then actually like. Three of them fell out before I had to get my surgery. So I was just like, oh, I guess I don't have to get all those teeth pulled. Which was nice, but I do know some people have had their braces for so long. But eight years, is that's a long time. Just making sure, sometimes I talk too much about Stardew Valley. Some streamers haven't played enough to understand it. Nah, I... Is it Neil? I hope it's Neil. Neil, I've, um, I have... 100% of the game on another file. So you are perfectly fine here. I don't mind whatsoever. I don't, there's no spoilers for me. If anything, things that you say will be good reminders for me or they will be um, helpful things that I didn't know. You know? 
And of course, if anybody else doesn't want any like severe spoilers, then if anything is said, feel free to speak up. But I don't mind. I don't mind at all. We're all just chilling, and I love experiencing how excited everybody else is about Stardew as well. I also saw an article about the Haunted Chocolatier. I didn't read it, but I saw like the title, and like I guess like we're some big things are coming from Concern Date. So I don't know if anybody actually read the title. Sorry, I have to reset you like every five seconds. <laughs> um, I don't know if anybody actually like read an article about it, but I I saw one. I just don't know what exactly it said. I just saw the frog jump. Precious. Where's my husband? I think he's outside. Also, I thought it was supposed to rain today. But maybe that was just a message from Pierre that to mess with me. I don't know. I had to get two pulled embraces. Oof. I feel like... I don't know. I don't trust... I don't trust dentists or orthodontist i really hated my orthodontist they were not nice to me or my mouth they would be like so rough and i would be in so much pain i feel like it's it's normal to have pain like when you get your braces fixed and all that kind of stuff but they did some things that i was like i don't feel like this is okay i really don't because my dad was like i don't feel like i should have to like make you stay home the rest of the day after visiting the orthodontist from being in pain i don't feel like that's a normal thing no, it would just hurt so bad. I skimmed an article about it. It's another solo game, so it's projected to take a while to come out. That's all I got from it. Got it. Okay. Makes sense. I'm assuming, I think somebody said 2024? 20, I might be making things up. I might be making that up. If I am, I'm so sorry. Please have mercy. Why did I not grab this one? All the poppy honey. Dentists and mechanics are scams. I agree. I agree, Neil. I I actually have a pretty good mechanic now who lives really close to my house and I trust them so much. They like fixed my brakes. Like I went to a place in Colorado before I left um, to get my brakes looked at and they're like, you can make it to California with these, but like try to make sure that you get them fixed like right when you get there essentially. So I waited. And then when I got here, I was like so intimidated because I'm like, I don't know where to go in California. I'm so lost. And then I, oh, I didn't say hi to any of these guys down here. Um, I went to this place like literally across the street from my house, like I, in walking distance. And I asked them, they're like, oh yeah, just bring your car in. And I was like, okay, well, how much is it going to be? And when I was at home, they told me getting my brakes fixed was going to be like, I want to say like 200, like, $50. I don't remember how much it was. And then here they were like, oh, it'll be like $90. And I, and I just sat there like, not that I want to spend $90 either. Like I'd rather spend no money, but that's way different. I was expecting to pay an arm and a leg in California to get my brakes fixed. So I was stunned and they're great. Like, it's not like I got gypped and the brakes are awful. They're good. They're good. Oh, did I mention that I just needed the Gerudo Tower? Yes. Yes, you did, Bogart. I don't remember. How do you get the Gerudo Tower? I can't remember what the what the way to do that one is. I'm trying to say, I guess. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. Midnight! Hello! Good, welcome in! How are you doing? Good to see you. Good to see you. What do you think? Oh, wait. Mechanic, yes. I like how we all agree. Mechanics can be a little stingy. Yeah, I got super screwed by mechanics before. And I know a lot of friends who have too. It's not, it's not a good situation. Especially if you need, like, if you have an older car and you find yourself there a lot, like, you definitely need to, somebody you can rely on and trust, and most of them you can't. So, that's just the way the cookie crumbles, I guess. Um, you. I need to make more of these. Honestly, honestly. What am I doing? What am I doing? Shipping. It's for you. Yeah. Okay. Let's go to the... Let's go to the island to find more bones. Happy New Year! 
Not yet. Malsy be cracked at starting things. Not really, but I am sure trying. Happy New Year. Happy New Year to you too? What do you mean, Happy New Year? It's for those of us for those of us who celebrate Christmas, it's Christmas Eve Eve. Or Christmas Eve, as I just realized for some. I'm trying to think of what day it is of Hanukkah. What day is it for Hanukkah? Is it day five? Day five? No, is it day six? <laughs> I was just thinking so hard. I like to be the first to say it. Well, you definitely were the first to say it, Midnight. That's for sure. You definitely beat the beat everybody else. <laughs> That's for sure. Mm -mm -mm. I'm going in. Mm -mm -mm. Box goes in the way of my button. My character tonight, this one? Boop. Her? Dun, dun, dun. She's in her summer gear. She looks like she's got little white go-go boot, go -go boots on. Doop, 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 doop. Yep, she looks pretty. She actually looks pretty cute. I won't lie. She looks pretty cute. Much cuter than, you know. <clears throat> While I wait for a Shrine Quest app and I'll chat with you guys. Well, welcome in, Bogart. I mean, you've already been here, but welcome in to the real party. What are these? Starfruit. That's what they are. I was like, what did I do here? All right, I needed to go to the dig site, not down here. I should get so excited. You change your character for seasons. I did. It, the first day of summer on like when we came, I think the beginning of one of the streams, I was like, all right, let's make her look like she's doing uh, it's summertime because we were in like more of a springtime outfit. So I changed her for summer because I thought it'd be cute. And I think it worked out. I mean, we did change her for the for the dance, the uh, flower dance. I made her dress up for my wedding with Sebastian. That's just the kind of girl I am. What can I say? Never mind, it came sooner than I thought. Bogart's like, I'll talk with you guys. Never mind, psych, bye. <laughs> See ya. They'll be back, right? They'll be back. Right? Just kidding. <laughs> What did you say, Victor? Oh, I found a double rainbow in Breath of the Wild. You, there's double rainbows in Breath of the Wild? Also, Victor, how close are you getting to perfection? Have you been grinding or are you just kind of grinding right now? Oh, an ancient trove, even though I don't need them anymore. All right, we got 18 more pieces. Of, oh, 21 more pieces of bone. Can't hate that. Whatever makes this easier. Clay. Okay. How many more? We got 27 more. I'll check how many that brings us up to in a second. Mm -mm -mm. Is that all of them? Yes. Okay, how many do we have now? 89? 89? Also, I put them in here. I didn't know we got that many. I gotta get them all back in my pockets. Can I hold this? Oh, jeez Louise. I messed up. Oh, Jesus. Nope, that's that's not worth it. <laughs> I'm just gonna sit here. Oh God, the sprinklers are those by the star fruit. I think they're just like the quality ones, the regular quality, not like the iridium sprinklers. They're just quality ones. Mm -mm -mm. Nice, Victor. Grinding as we speak. Got you. All right, let's put those in here. Anything else I need to put here? I want to keep this. Do I already have one? Oh, I do. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. I'll keep you two. Um. I get very into my sorting. Cool. All right, let's go back. 
I should have gone back the other way. But now I'm walking, so it's fine. Now we're going to go to the mines and try to get the last of these bones. Because we need to do this one for a, I think a crafting recipe? I think it's like the geode crusher or something like that. I can't remember exactly what it's called. Find another croc seed already. <laughs> you found one or you're trying to find one? Is that like a sheesh? Find another Korok seed already. I found one last time we played. It was purely by accident. Because I saw a glowy thing in the middle of the river. But now that I have that thing that college showed me, that is very helpful. The little like shows you where all the shrines and stuff are. Feels a little bit more doable. You know what I mean? Okie dokie, artichokey. We also need to give... What am I at? Penny's at five. Sandy's at seven. We need to give them some gifts. Oh, wrong place. Hi, Pam. Oh. <laughs> I was like, yeah, let's go to the desert. That's not where I went, meant to go. All right. All right. 71. 71. Hey. Gotcha. These rings, let me tell you what. Game changer. I love them so much. I'll have to tell college. I used them on my other save file, the combination that she told me about, but so great. I got my first Christmas card in my life today. What? Midnight? Congratulations. I mean, I guess it's not a big congratulations, but that's more of, that's super exciting. It's from a streamer. A streamer sent you a Christmas card? That's so cute. I thought about sending everybody something um, earlier. I was like, I'd like to get everybody in the community something. But I was like, my brain went, I should send everybody, like buy everybody a game or something. I'm like, do you know how expensive that would be if you bought everybody a game? Like, what, what do you, what would you think? Unless the game costed like a penny, sure. But who do you think you are? Who do you think you are? But still, it'd be fun to do something. <laughs> the bus reminds me of the one promo of Haunted Chocolatier. The bus of decoration on it. I'd be if it was paint or flowers. Um, with a lot of decoration on it. Oh, wait. But it was pretty cool. I'll have to look at what you mean, Bogart. I don't think I've seen that. But the bus now in this mod is super cool. I saw it and I screamed because I was like, this is the bee's knees. The bee's freaking knees. There we go. Nice. I need skeletons. Please. Please. I believe. I believe. Well, that's a lot of ore. That's good. We need that for kegs. Look at me, keg based. I'm all about money now in this game. Oh no. Oh no. Please, please, back up, back up. Okay. Find the stairs, I found them, but is there any more skeletons over here now that I think about it? Hey guys, hey guys. I see a frozen tear up there that I need to get from my husband. Oh, did I do it? Oh, I did do it. Let's go down. <laughs> that was so casual. I'm just like, did I do it? Did it. Sick. Okay, we beat that one. Bulk postcards probably the way to go. That's what she did. That's super smart. I'd love to do that. Now it's too late, but I'll remember for next year. Or maybe I'll send everybody a, a um, belated one or a Happy New Year thing. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Midnight, are you doing anything exciting? Four. Sorry, I'm saying everything in like fragmented sentences. Are you doing anything exciting for Christmas? That's a question for everybody, honestly. Is anybody doing anything exciting? Are you traveling to any relative's house? I'm not. I'm staying home. I'm not doing anything. Oh, I put those away. Oh, the museum. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, wait. I had, eight, <laughs> I had 89, so I need 11. And now? Okay. 
now. We're gonna go here. Hi, Clint. Hi, Clint. I might stream. Midnight, you're gonna stream? Heck yes. On Christmas? That's super exciting. I will try to stop in if you do. I'm gonna should be chilling, so. Why does why does Gunther look like that? He looks kind of creepy. Oh, you're just gonna be on Twitch. Got it. I thought about streaming on Christmas and I was like, don't do that. Don't do that. Just 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 chill. Plus, Trevor's gonna be getting ready. Trevor is going to Tim the Milkman is going to England on Monday. So he's gonna be doing laundry and packing on Christmas. So then after that, hopefully I'll be doing lots of <laughs> streaming because I'll be here alone. I do have to take care of his brother's cats and everything, but I'll be alone. The operator, hello, welcome in. I'm just gonna be drink. I don't have water, so I'm drinking boba. Mm. Sorry. <laughs> Victor, that's still exciting though. Just you and your parents. Sometimes it's fun to just see, like, just spill with, like, hang out with family. Okay. Gus's birthday was yesterday. That's right. It showed me a message. Tomorrow's birthday is tomorrow. Boba's an acceptable substitute. I'm glad, operator. Thank you. My family's all traveling, so I might spoil my dog a bit and then do my third ever stream. The operator, am I following you? I'm following you. So if you do stream, I'll get the notification, and I will try to be there on Christmas. Because I'm not really doing anything. I'll probably do some writing for my other job and chill. Because I have that Monday off too. But then I have to bring Trevor to the airport that night. But still. I'll be chilling. Hopefully. Nothing too crazy going on. So I'll try to jump in any streams or do anything. Also, Midnight. Am I following you? Am I following you, Midnight? I am now. <laughs> so I'll come check out your stream if I'm around. <clears throat> I think, Victor, I think I followed you though. I'm not sure since I'm getting a new Switch game. Oh, I'll be w wanting to play that. What Switch game are you getting, Midnight? I have Switch Lite and can't stream. Oh, yeah, you can't stream off a of Switch Lite, which is annoying. My best friend wants to stream on her Switch, too, and she can't because she's got a Switch Lite. But she's trying to get the new one, the, like, OLED. Is that, do you just call it OLED, or do you have to do, like, OLED? Trevor called it OLED, and I'm like, is that what it's called? <laughs> I was like, do people call it that, or is that a you thing? Is that a you thing? Kirby! I love Kirby! I love Kirby so much. I haven't gotten the new game, though. I looked into it the other day. I love Kirby so much. That's super exciting, though, Midnight. Do you, did you get it already, or are you getting it for Christmas? I just ended a short Eastward stream that that was mired by technical difficulties and a surprising and suddenly over, overly needy dog. Oh, Operator, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. The technical difficulties are super annoying, and I... Get the needy pet, the needy pet thingy, because my cats get needy in the middle of the stream sometimes too. But next time, but all lesson learn lessons learned for next streams, you know. So now you know. I still get technical difficulties all the time, but I'm still a little noob nerd burger. So who knows? I really want the OLED. Yeah, it's it's really cool looking. I like the white and the black. Like I think it looks so clean and awesome. But what other special features does it have? I don't really know. People say OLED. Okay, well then let me say that because OLED? OLED. No, I said it right. OLED. I never say OLED. I know. I thought it was OLED. Bone mill. Oh, the luau. I think I have stuff ready for the luau, so I don't think we need to stress. I looked so confused though. I was like, <laughs> I need to go to Marnie's to get hay because it was Tuesday yesterday and she wasn't open. So we got to go see her today. Little foot. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, they're mad at me. Oh, they're mad. Oh, they're mad. Not all of them, but most of them. Please don't be mad. Please don't be mad. I love you all so much. Trust me, I'm trying my best. I got 100, 100 bones yesterday. On a totally unrelated note, I'm conflicted over whether or not I should get a divorce from Sam. Well, it has been a year, Patchy, since you did play and marry him. So if you'd like to divorce him and try a new option, I'd say go for it. 
It is very sad to divorce somebody in this game, though. I tell you what. Like pencil lead. Got it, midnight. Got it. Okay. It's so cool seeing the chat as a Stardew Valley style font. Is that what it looks like? <laughs> I hope so. I just got a follow from I don't like your voice. I don't think that's a good thing. L E D O LED M O LED. I think it's a bad thing if somebody named I don't like your voice follows you. Isn't that a bad thing? <laughs> well, regardless, welcome in. Glad to have you here. Might be a little worried. <laughs> My neck hurts today. Oh no, midnight, what'd you do? Or did you just like hold it in a different position for too long? Gonna go lay down night. Love you. Night Joe. Love you too. Talk to you tomorrow, probably, but have a good night. Take care of yourself. Oh my goodness. Trade in the old husband for a new one, like an old car with too many miles on it? Exactly. If I didn't like it, I wouldn't follow. So my voice is okay. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> Don't use the crying face. Now I feel bad. I'm so sorry. But welcome in. Glad to have you here. So glad to have you here. <laughs> I slept on the feet side of my bed. Maybe that side isn't as worn down. Why did you do that, Midnight? I used to do that when I was younger because it was just like fun. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. But why did you do that? Did you just fall asleep that way? It's lovely. Thank you. Thank you so much. I feel weird calling you. I don't like your voice. <laughs> you could just say I don't. But thank you very much. That's very sweet. Your voice is very soothing if someone says otherwise. <laughs> oh God, I'm not even going to read the rest. But thank you. You're silly. IDK, I was up at 4 a.m. Midnight, I feel like you always stay up so late. You're a little night owl. I mean, I can relate, but make sure you get yourself some good sleep. What were you doing at 4 a.m., by the way? You saying divorcing someone nonchalantly out of context is funny. <laughs> oh, I know. I feel so bad. It's like... <laughs> I mean, it's so funny. Yeah, if you didn't know we're talking about the game, it sounds really bad. Because when I started reading the message, I'm like, is this someone going to say they're trying to make a... Their mind up about genuinely divorcing somebody? Or is... Should I should I be worried? You know, like, I'm just like... I don't know if I should be worried. Are we talking about Stardew? And thankfully it was Stardew. Oh gosh, nothing makes sense at 4 a.m. That's true. That's very true. I will take I will take that explanation tonight. My current think is to marry Mario, but I only have 460k in all year until I get my wine age, so I'm not sure if I can afford it. How much is it to divorce somebody? I can't remember. Is it 100K? Seems like a lot. Voice is adequate or whatever you like. Okay, I'll use voice. Because <laughs> it's funny, I was going to use I don't. But I'll use voice. That's better. My inventory's full. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, geez, Louise. Uh, <laughs> let's just sell some things. Yes, I think these were all just for the purpose of selling. Yeah, those are definitely for the purpose of selling. Okay, cool. That's cool. Cool, cool, cool. A streamer I was like doing a 40 hour stream. Oh, a streamer you like was doing a 40 hour stream. Got it, got it. Who was that? Midnight? I I want to do a 24 hour stream someday. It's a very intimidating idea, but it'd be super fun. Super crazy, super fun. Honestly. Someday. Someday I shall do it. I don't know. Oh, it's 50k. Okay, that's not bad. The memory wipe divorce at beautiful. <laughs> we we had to do the memory wipe on Penny after the divorce because I was like near tears. I felt so bad for um, the way she reacted to me. I was like, I have to make her forget. But also I needed it for completion. I just felt so bad though, man. She's such a gem. And I was like, I'm a monster. I'm a straight up monster. Speaking of Penny, we should go get her, give her a gift. And Sandy. Summer Forge. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. You in college have very soothing voices. Aw, thanks, Victor. That's very nice. Sorry, I'm so behind on reading. I don't would be confusing since people ask you stuff. I, I think. Exactly. Yep, you're right. You're right. I didn't say it was a great idea. It was just an idea. Oh, even in game divorce is realistically expensive. I know, that's true. Why can't it just be free? Jerbifer? She's still going? Oh, she sings and plays Valorant. Oh, that's cute. 
I I like watching Valorant streams because I like seeing people who are actually good at the game. I my boyfriend actually works with somebody who streamed Valorant for quite a while. He he was like one of the first people I kind of connected with when I started streaming. And he doesn't stream anymore because I think he's actually on like a professional team for Valorant now. And he's been like working with my boyfriend but also doing that so he doesn't have any time to stream anymore. And I'm like, that's pretty crazy. I was, I was going to say, can I join like a professional Stardew team? But like, no, because of my speedrunner, no. What would I possibly contribute other than amazing fishing skills that anybody else could have? <laughs> nothing. The answer is nothing. You divorced Penny, definitely a monster. Listen, boys. I had a point redeem. Somebody redeemed it, and we had to divorce Penny. And that same person wants me to make one for Sebastian, but I'm refusing. I'd feel so bad. I mean, maybe at some point I should do it. She wants me to bring her a melon. I could do that. I could do that. Penny, what are we at? Just five still. That makes sense. That makes sense. Also, I don't have memory wipes, so I would unfortunately have to deal with the consequences of my actions. But wouldn't you... Can't you get memory wipe? Or is that expensive too? I can't remember how much that is. I like requesting Lost Boy on her stream. Her cover is so soothing. Aww. Oh, I love Lost Boy. I just remember, like realized what song that was. That's such a good song. I haven't heard that in forever. Such a soothing song. I'll have to check her out. Jerbifer. I don't have a piece of paper in front of me. I don't know. I'll figure it out. <laughs> I'll remember. I'll remember. I'll have to. But you made the redeem, granting the opportunity to a monster. Whoa, look at this. This looks so different. To a monster to make you... <laughs> I'm the OG monster. Yes, voice. I will give you that. But I've never... I never divorced anybody before. So I was like, I wonder what it's like. And it was horrible. I never want to do it again. Never. Professional starting player is to be Abigail in Easter egg hunt. Okay, well, I've done that. Every single year. So... I guess I'm somebody... Right? I'm somebody cool? I don't know. No, as in, I don't have the Witch's Swamp quest. Oh, got it. That's how you do it. That's true. And you all are keeping the kids or... Look, here. Voice, I'll show you. I'll show you what the, what the dealio is. <laughs> the boba ball was, like, stuck. <laughs> I was scared. I was like, I'm not getting anything out of the straw. Mm-hmm. Okay, so, Sebastian and I do sleep in the room that Penny, um, decorated for her and I, still. I need to get the furniture thing so I can redo it myself, but we have one son together. The other child is Sebastian, nice child, and this is him. He used to have fiery red hair like Penny, and then we got divorced, and it turned brown like mine, and then the next day it went to this purple. So I'm pretty, we've been saying it's like him going through like an angsty phase. Um, yeah. <laughs> he's going through an emo phase. He's, he's um, acting out because he's upset with me for divorcing his mother. I don't know. But he chose me. He's staying with me, you know. But now we definitely have to get the house renovation for Penny because I feel so bad. She usually starts with Valorant 8 p.m. our time and doesn't sing until like 2 a.m. Just so you know. Oh my goodness. Does she usually do such long streams? Midnight? That's long. Professional Stardew player wears Lewis's underpants. We have done that as well. And we went to go talk to um, Marnie when we did it. So. Breaking Penny's heart is worse than loving Shane. Oh no. Oh no. Is it really? They're called boba balls? Oh, they're not. They're tapioca balls or whatever they're called. I just call them that because it's easier. That's my MO. Have tried the Stardew Valley board game? No, but I was looking into it the other day. I really want to get it, but it's so expensive. I was I was super interested in getting it, though. I'd like to try. Oh, the hay. Here we go. Hey now, hey now. This is what dreams are made of. I brought you guys some hay. I brought the hay. No, it's not a phase. It's a metamorphosis. <laughs> is that a, what you meant? Am I saying that wrong? Metamorphosis? Oh, no. Yeah, like eight hours. That's why I'm always up late. Oh, my goodness. She's amazing. 
like I said, someday, someday that'll be me when I don't have to work a real job or I'm not sick. Someday. Remember that day I streamed for six hours and everybody yelled at me? Everyone was like, what are you still doing here? I was like, ah, please don't. Enjoying Cult of the Lamb a little bit too much was what, what the problem was. I was just a little too into it. It was bad. It was bad. I thought it was just boba. Oh, see, that's probably what it is. Have you guys heard of those little bi juices? See, I call them bi juice. They're like B-A-I. They're little buys in the store you can, you can get. I used to be obsessed with them, and I got my dad obsessed with them a while ago. And I'd tell him when he went to the store, I'm like, can you get some of that bi juice? And he's like, one day he just turns to me and goes, it's not called bi juice. It's just called bi. Like, you just call them bi. And I was like, but it doesn't sound as good. And I was like, I don't know why. I was like, bi juice. Not bi, bi juice. It sounds so much better. But he was so, he was just like, it's, that's not what it's called. <laughs> he's like, please stop. He was very passionate about it. I think this is all I need. I need to get it all. It's like saying chai tea. Oh no, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm I'm offending people. I know nothing. That's all you need to remember. I, I don't know anything. I like Stardew Valley and Skyrim, which have board games that combine expensive <laughs> expensive than my bills. How much is the Skyrim Skyrim game? I feel like that's super expensive. Stardew Valley needs a mystery mod. That'd be so cool. They do have a rogue mod. I haven't tried it yet, but they do have one. And I've heard it's amazing. Also, we know sexiness and some friends are making a Hogwarts mod. Not to, not to spoil the surprise, but I'm very interested. I was definitely supposed to help with the dialogue and then my life happened, so. <laughs> Bye is great. I'm glad we all agree. I used to be obsessed because they had so many different flavors too. It was so good. Like the strawberry lemonade one, that one hit hard. I used to get the blueberry one all the time. I didn't matter. I just liked them all. But the strawberry lemonade one, so good. So good. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing, boys. I was like, the amount of times I've said bye, it sounds like I'm talking about something else. As it, it is strange to hear chai tea. So you just call it chai, right? That's what you're supposed to just call it is chai. Can the spouses divorce you in the game? We just talked about this the other day. I think they can. I think they can initiate the divorce if you're like not good to them. Like, if you don't give them gifts or, like, you don't talk to them ever, I'm pretty sure they can start the divorce. I'm doing more chores. Gotta get that good money. Gotta get the good money. I also have more milk. And I have so many eggs. Let's get this back stock out of here. Oh, jeez Louise. I also need to go get, um, try to get more dragon toots. Because... We're gonna need that for an obelisk eventually. And I think that's the only one that I'm kind of slacking on the, like, materials. I was gonna say ingredients. I'm like, the building ingredients. That's what went through my head. Is it Aya's? I hope I'm saying that right. Aya's baby. Hello, welcome in, how are you? I got some ice cream and cranberry for Christmas today. Ooh, that sounds yummy. Ice cream and cranberry. Hmm. Mm. Mm. Just chai. Okay, got it. <laughs> Patchy's like me too. Well, just like, is there something wrong with saying chai tea? Or is it like different? I don't know. I feel like they call it chai tea when if you go and like order it somewhere, but that could just be America. RGB Ronnie, hello, welcome in. How are you? Good to see you. How's it been going? Sorry, I'm just putting things in my furnace. But welcome in, welcome in, hello. Aes is a sturdy player too. Oh, really? Oh, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Oh, that's, I see, I see. Well, I'm gonna follow then. I'm gonna follow and check out the stream. Let me also give them a shout out if they do Stardew and stream so that people can go see. And I'll give RGB Ronnie a nice little shout out because we love our Ronnie in here. I'm losing my mind. I'm doing things and I'm losing my mind. But yes, you guys should go give them a follow. I'm interested to check in 
A's? Am I saying that right? I feel like it's so wrong. I'm interested to go check out the stream too. And Ronnie, I watch secretly all the time. I come and lurk all the time because I'm a little loser like that. Is that a chocolate chair combat orient oriented? I don't know how that will turn out. I don't know. I don't know much. After not long reflection, I'm getting a divorce. <laughs> oh, Patchy. In Stardew, guys. In Stardew. Just so everybody knows. It's like saying TT. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. It's pronounced ice. Thank you. That is so much. That helps. I was like... I'm saying this so wrong. Ronnie, I'm doing well. How are you doing? Good to see you. You were playing Marchuary Assistant? Oh my gosh. How did it go? How did it go? <laughs> I saw it. Wait. Oh, okay. They know each other. Got it. I'm getting... I'm getting... I'm catching up. All I appreciate your lyrics. I lurk in your stream constantly too. Really, Ronnie? We're just creeping on each other. That's what's been going on. Yeah, no, I really do. I come and lurk because your stream is so cozy. Like when I get home from work sometimes and I just want something on in the background, I'm like, I'm just going to put Ronnie on. <laughs> Ronnie's home, Ronnie's streaming, I'm going to watch. And it's very nice. It's very nice. More assistant, crazy. I know, Mortuary Assistant is crazy. Remember when we raided, was it Alyssa Avocado, who we love? Didn't we raid her and she was playing and it was Santa on the table? I was going to say, Ronnie, were you live today? If I missed it. Oh, Bogart, you're such a gem. Such a gem. Bogart's always, like, when I go t um, creep on other people's streams who, like, have raided us or we've raided, I usually see Bogart there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But the Santa's creepy. Ronnie, I have to say, the Santa's creepy. BSM7, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Glad to have you here. Sorry, I just had boba. <laughs> I'm still chewing the boba. Enjoy your quiet and lurk. So glad to have you. I will search for gameplay with the rogue mod. Sounds nice. Yeah, people love the rogue mod. And we, we've talked about trying it out here. I think that'll be kind of like maybe once we get done with completion, that'll be kind of like the next sort of thing we do um, is trying different mods. And because I, I do really want to try Stardew Expanded. I've never tried it like personally. And every time I kind of watch a stream of Stardew Expanded, I try not to give too much away for myself. So I kind of just focus on, like, the streamer and, like, other little bits and bobs. But, um, I want to try it. <laughs> All I have to say, I want to try it. Molly, you take away my anxiety. Midnight, that is honestly one of the nicest things anybody has said to me. <laughs> that means a lot. I really hope so. I hope I can be helpful that way. And if it makes you feel better, you help take away some of my anxiety, too. Since I've been watching your streams, my mental health is so much more positive. <laughs> Sorry, I felt like crying. <laughs> I was like, am I okay? I just stopped for a second. I'm so glad, Midnight. That makes me feel really, really happy. And I'm obviously always here to talk about anything if you ever need somebody, but I'm so glad I could contribute to that and make things a little bit more positive for you. So thank you so much. I'm so glad. Sorry. <clears throat> um... What kind of boba, if that's okay to ask? Yes, operator, of course. It's the Thai tea, Thai milk tea. I said it looks kind of like clay water. It's really good, though. It's really good. I love it. It's very sweet. I'm trying SD Expanded right now, and it's been really fun. Really, Cody? Is this your first time doing it? I guess it is, because you said you're trying it. But do you like it more than vanilla? I feel like most people do. I feel like most people do. I want to try it so bad, because it looks so good. And I want all the new people. I want Sophia. Sophia is so cute. I want to do a JoJo playthrough next in the next expanded. I did the JoJo playthrough on my own. Kind of breaks your soul a little bit. But it, was, it wasn't it was so bad. It wasn't so bad. Um, but Ronnie, maybe we'll be around the same time frame then. Doing expanded. That'd be cool. What's the most weirdest mod you've ever seen? Console player here, so I'm not sure. Probably... I don't like the ones that change your horse to look, make it look like Pam. And I also don't like when I saw, like, a mod that, like, changes all of your animals into, like, weird, like, mermaid sea creatures with, like, abs. I've seen that one before, and that was really disturbing. Um, what was the other one? Oh, there's a lot of, like, weird ones I've seen that, like, focus a lot on Abigail and Haley and, like, a very um 
an appropriate manner and those were like I didn't I, I only saw them like in the stores and stuff and I was just kind of like no nope, that's okay I kind of refused to watch stream because I, when we raided Alyssa and watched her play MA I got scared oh no Bogart no 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 I did get scared during that too when somebody like popped out so I promise there's no jump scares here for a scary game I refused to watch yeah that one's pretty creepy pretty creepy focusing on Bob's huh I thought you had a boyfriend wait what what do you mean voice on Bob's. Did you mean Boba? I'm so confused. But I hope you had fun, Ronnie. Yeah, Martin Mortuary System. I couldn't play it alone. I couldn't play it on stream or I'd cry. Thank you. It's nothing deep. I just noticed myself way happier. Aw. Ever since I've been a fan. Midnight, I'm so glad. See? I got a stream. That's why you keep streaming. <laughs> I love vanilla. It's really fun to have new things to explore and the new NPCs are so sweet. Yeah, vanilla is awesome. But yeah, the new things to explore and like NPCs, they're super cool. That's another thing with like Ridge Side. I want to do that one too, but I feel like getting Ridge Side and Expanded would be so much. That'd be so many new characters and so much to like take in. You know what I mean? Uh, you got me by Pam as a horse. <laughs> Pam, the Pam horse mod is just horrific. It's absolutely horrifying. I couldn't do it. I didn't get it, but I saw somebody else had it, and I was like, no. The only reason I wiped your memory was so you could feel what it was like to fall in love with me all over again. Well, it's really sad when you do wipe their memory, because the next time you talk to them, they're like, you seem so familiar, like I've known you before. And then I, f I felt so guilty. I was just like, that's because we were married. But I did joke about, like, I was like, what if when we get near completion, we divorce Sebastian, then we remarry Penny, and it's like we rekindled our, our love, you know? Wouldn't that be something? The wine is done. The wine is done. The sun is shining. The tank is clean. <gasps> the tank is clean. Sorry. I say that one all the time. That one's hilarious. Wait. Have you seen the Hobbit Hole house mod? It's so cute. I want to use it for my next playthrough along with the Elf Ear mod. I've seen the Elf Ear mod, but I haven't seen the Hobbit Hole. No. I want to see those. That sounds adorable. Cash pack. Oh. I got a rebate. I got a rebate. And the, today's the luau, I believe. I believe. I think it is. I have to I have to think it is. That's why our kid is emo. His mom doesn't recognize him. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's true. I know. But I, that would be interesting if you didn't make her wipe her memory. If she would come back and like visit him or if that was kind of somehow canon I think that'd be really cool but yeah now that you said that voice that's really tripping me up <laughs> I'm like that's a good point he remembers his mom not that that's like a canon thing in the game but technically he would remember his mom but his mom doesn't remember him now that's pretty messed up I'm gonna go see what Sam thinks now. Oh no, Patchy, tell us what he says. Cause Penny just tells me not to talk to her when that happened. Oh my gosh, this trial be, do be hard. I died to the spikes first thing in the Rhoda Chiga Shrine. I don't think I've been in that one. Maybe I have Bogart. They all kind of, they all kind of blend together after a while. <laughs> Never mind. it's called skill issue. Oh, so you gotta test your skills, which makes more sense now. Why the kids don't grow up in the game because that would be a different game. Raising kids is a whole new genre. It'd be cool if they could age up though. Like in The Sims and stuff. There is in Harvest Moon, I'm pretty sure you have to like inspire your kid to kind of go into something. Like the old game. You have to like inspire your child to pick kind of like one thing that they want to like explore. And then, um,. You kind of see how your relationship is affected and what kind of parent you are. And if you do well in one year, they'll age up or like something will happen, they'll go off and do it. But if you don't have a good relationship or do it correctly, it takes two years. I don't know. It's been a long time since I played that game, but um, it's really cool because they become like an older child and, and you get to see kind of that relationship and it's, I don't know. I liked it. Oh, the luau has begun. I'm checking the wine. Okay. None of that is changed uh and you did it again with the spikes oh god we're co-parenting yep it is messed up it really is voice you just kind of gave me like a 
midlife crisis. No, he said, I'm sorry, I don't think I can be your friend now. And he looks so sad, all patchy. <laughs> That's super sad. I love Sam. I just started a new playthrough for fun. I don't know if I'm gonna actually like move forward with it too much, but I think if I do, I'm gonna marry Sam because I've always wanted to. <laughs> you broke his heart, but now you can pursue Maru, I suppose. Hi, Kyle. Welcome in, Kyle. Look, I got James's present to me. I got my Bakugo. I don't know if he told you. He sent me another Bakugo for Christmas. But hello, I hope you're doing well. Merry Christmas Eve Eve. Hopefully you're staying warm. Oh, you can't talk to him anymore, that's so sad. Oh, it's a DLC shrine. Well, then I definitely don't have it, Bogart. Definitely don't. Starvest Moon holds your kid back a year if you're a bad parent. Yeah, it does. Boys, you just have all the, you have a lot of good points. I'm blowing my mind. I'm blowing my mind. What year are you in on this playthrough? I'm in year four. Hiccup McGuppy, that's an amazing name. I am in year four currently. Hi, Curtin! Welcome in! Oh, Curtin, you just saw the Bakugo? Hello. It's pretty amazing, but good to see you, good to see you. Hardly quarter, you're young, I guess. I guess it would be like a quarter, quarter crisis. Do you mostly play farming genre games? Is that why you bought Stardew Valley? Um... I think Stardew Valley was gifted to me originally years ago, but it was gifted to me for that reason. Um, Katie, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. And Hiccup McGuffey, I love that name. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Um, I do play quite a bit of um, farming simulators, but I mean, I also play a lot of different games. I play a lot of team fighting tactics. I play a lot of... Um, I play a lot of Fortnite now because that's what my friends play and I want to spend time with them because we don't live in the same place. Um, what else do I play? I played Cult of the Lamb on stream. We played Breath of the Wild on stream. Um, but I do have a really big heart for simulators. I, I've loved them for forever. And I was playing The Sims earlier today, just chilling because they're just comfort games. And I'm a, definitely a big casual gamer. Um, I do like some little hard things here and there, but like harder games, but I, I do really enjoy a good casual playthrough of things because that's how I unwind, you know, that's how I unwind. I was so close to getting you a Deku Funko Pop today. Oh, Deku, Curtin, that'd been so cute, but no gifts. Don't send me anything. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Please. Always, anyways, if Mario Time has enough presents, wait, only give her love gifts, so that's a good, I guess. Oh. Got you, Patchy. Got you. The Deku would have been an adorable, Curtin, but no more gifts. Thanks. <laughs> Curtin, I found something I really want to get you, um, but I don't know if I could trust who's selling it, so I need to figure out something else. I am an overthinker as well, voice, but your overthinking is kind of amazing. Not to say that in a negative light, but you think about things I'm not thinking about, which is very interesting. Hi, I'm, he told me how fun. Wait. I might be presents going to bed and driving to Nebraska tomorrow. Oh my gosh, you're going to Nebraska. That's pretty amazing. We should go get some sleep and get your chores done. Kyle, I always love seeing you in here. That's super exciting. Be safe when going to Nebraska though. I've heard it's, it's a little scary. The drive might be a little scary. I just gotta talk to everybody now. Oh, just letting you know I don't stream with camera. That's okay, Midnight. I enjoy some streams without camera. Very relaxing. Katie, thank you so much. It's a lot of mods for the farm, um, aesthetic mods, but I think the organization also helps, so thank you very much. We worked hard. We worked hard to make it pretty. Does the Palio one release final, finally? Oh, it did, yes. I think, I think I know what you're talking about, voice. Yes, I think. Is that what it's called? How did I never know that? But yes, <laughs> it did. If what you're talking about is what I think I'm talking about, then it did. I feel like we just did the luau. But maybe I'm thinking of when we did our community stream, which we need to do another community stardew stream. But we'll wait until the holidays are over. You know what I mean? I got already got you a gift, Mwaha, and when I send it, I demand you open it upon open it up on stream. Okay, curtain. I love that. But also you shouldn't have got me a gift in the first place, but I'm excited. I'm excited to open it. Now I'm really excited. Open it up on the stream. Hmm, hmm, hmm. 
I'll make sure that I tell you if you're and make sure that you're here if I when I'm opening it up on said stream Is there a mod that lets other people take different roles? What if you want to compete with Pierre or Robin or run for mayor? That would be so sick, but I don't think there is currently voice. It'd be really cool though They should get on that Somebody call sexiness back and tell them to, to do it <laughs> There are our mod god Mod god do I talk to you guys? And I was just, yeah, I did. I'm good. I've had fam in town the last couple weeks. So I've been busy and like secret one, <laughs> secret watching stream. Thanks, Curtin, for secretly watching. Thank you. Curtin, do you have anything exciting planned for tomorrow for Christmas Eve? Tell me. Tell me everything. Are you going up to the mountains or anything? At least someone gets happiness from this mind. <laughs> I do, boys. I really do. Hell is the other cozy farming type game. Oh, 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 oh. Then I don't know what you're talking about. Um, I think they did though. I feel like I heard somebody else talking about it. Should I, should I look into that one? So this is my issue is I get lost on the Steam store because I'm like, look at all of these different farming games. So I'm like, stop playing so many farming games. You're going to have just a whole library full of farming games. And especially if you're streaming, I don't think that's all we're going to want to watch. I do kind of want that new like Harvestella game, but I don't know. I don't know. We do need to beat Little Nightmares too, though. Still. So we need to schedule a time for us to do that. We started it, but we haven't finished it. Oh, I didn't even realize the little Junimos are banging drums over here. Did you guys see that? Alright, let's start this shindig. Let's start it. Hopefully he likes the tea. Bedtime for me. Hope I can catch the stream another time. Bye, Cody. Have a great night. Get some good sleep. Thank you for coming in, and thanks for following, but have a good night. Sweet. Hope they make that mod. That would be cool. That would be really cool. They've been working on some other mods, but imagine, imagine. I'm always here, but I am excited. I'm excited too, Curtin, because now I'm really curious what it could be. Mm-hmm. Mm. I should show you guys what my boyfriend's mom got me for Christmas. It just got delivered yesterday, and it was like a really big box, and we were like, oh, I think this is like a joint gift. And I opened it up, and I'm like, I knew. I'll have to show you what I saw, Curtin. I'm going to go get it in a second. I want to show you how much I saw of it before I knew immediately what it was. Because it's disgusting. Um, it'll be a random Molly effect that you guys will all learn in a second. Another thing that I love that I don't know if I've ever talked about on stream before. But I'll go get it. You may like Palia and Yokai Inn. I feel like I've heard of Yokai Inn. If they're cozy games, I bet I'd be interested. Mm -hmm. Okay. He loves the soup. The soup is out of this world. Mm -mm. Sorry for my phrasing voice. No, I was disgustingly excited. But it's an, an amazing gift. It's not disgusting. It's amazing. My nose is clogged. I gotta go blow it. So let me go blow my nose. Let me use the restroom. Let me get the gift. And then I'll be back. Alright. I'll be right back, friends. Talk amongst yourselves. Tell me everything great when I return. Okay, BRB.
Hello. Don't be scared. I'm back. Hello, hello. I just saw voice say that they liked Curtin's name, and I was there when Curtin made the name. <laughs> and it's amazing. You do need to start streaming again, though, Curtin. I agree, I agree, I agree. I was thinking about you earlier today. You definitely need to start streaming. And we were talking about the OLED um, Switch earlier, which you definitely need to get. So delicious ice cream is so the, my favorite. It's vegan. The oat milk ones are creamy and good. I love oat milk ice cream. So good. So, so good. Wait, what did Bogart, what did Twitch do that was good? You guys were talking so much about ice cream. I love it. Would be bad if someone clipped it. I'm so confused. <laughs> All right, I'm back. I like watching that game. Building worlds is fascinating. Wait, which game? Somebody tell me. <laughs> Major plot twist, finding out Curtin is a girl. Did you think Curtin, you didn't think Curtin was a girl this whole time? What'd you think? And so I got the new Switch, I definitely will. Yes, Curtin, okay. Sims, oh yes, okay. Midnight also didn't know I was a girl. <laughs> what did you think? Okay, let me show you this GIF. I'm trying to think about the best way to show it. So let me tell you, I'll show you the gift and I'll tell you how much I saw of the gift. Curtin, you'll understand. Um, before I knew what it was, it's big. Um, so let me hold it up. Oh, it's heavy. Okay, here's a random Molly fact that you're all gonna learn right now. Um, ugh. Can you see it? Wait. <laughs> I can't see if you can see it. There she is. It's Audrey Hepburn. I love Audrey Hepburn. I have had an obsession with her since I was in like high school, which if you don't know my age, I'm much out of high school. Um, I saw this much of it, like here, this, her foot. And I was like, oh my God. <laughs> and Trevor, Tim, the milkman just goes, uh, what, what is it? And I go, it's Audrey. And he's like, what? And then I opened the rest of it. He goes, oh, it's, oh my God. It's, uh, it's, um, Audrey Hepburn. And I was like, yeah. And I know that from just the foot. So there you go. <laughs> so sweet. You got a portrait of yourself. Don't, don't say that to me. I'll cry. Um, yes, I love Audrey Hepburn very much. I saw Breakfast at Tiffany's. Actually, fun fact, Audrey Hepburn reminds me a lot of my mother. Um, so when I saw, I was in Minnesota visiting family and one of my older cousins and I were having like a movie night my first night there. And she's like, have you ever seen Breakfast at Tiffany's? And I was like, no, I've never seen it. So she put it on and I was like five minutes in, 10 minutes in, but there's, there's some problematic things in that movie, but it's also very good. I've also read the book and they're very different, but I was like, oh my God, I love this movie. And it got really late. So we were like, we'll have to finish it tomorrow. Actually, I might've stayed up and watched it alone, but cause she'd seen it a million times and she was older than me. So she's like, I'm going to go to bed. She was responsible. Um, but like literally like 10 minutes in, my cousin just turns to me and she's like, she reminds me of your mom. And I was just sitting there and I was like, I was thinking the same exact thing. I was like, she reminds me so much of my mom. So I don't know. But my college professor when I, uh, told me once that I was, I reminded her of Audrey Hepburn and I was like, that means a lot. <laughs> so thank you. Waiting for the Zoomer who calls themselves Audrey, Audrey Sickburn. What? What do you mean? Malzi, are you wearing cow pajamas? No, I'm wearing... Look, here I am. I'm wearing Snoopy. Oh, you can't see. Snoopy. I got these because my sister and I used to get, see Snoopy's all over them. Um, my, my sister and I know your pants. Oh no, it's a blanket. <laughs> it's a blanket. Um, as in sick burn, bro. Oh my gosh. When they, they toast each other. Oh, okay. Got it. Got it. Um, yeah, no, my sister and I, for two years, would get, like, the first year we kind of got matching sweaters for Christmas, and then the second year, I think I still have the sweater, but um, the second year we both just kind of got, like, casual Christmas shirts, and we wore, like, leggings, and I saw this one, and I was like, I'm getting Snoopy, because I love Snoopy, and it's very comfy cozy. So I was getting ready to stream tonight, and I was like, I want to wear something Christmas-themed, and I was like, what do I have? And this was in, like, my under the bed kind of stash. So I put it on. There you go. The rest is history. All right, let me get back to business. Sorry. Thank you for allowing me to show you my Audrey Hepburn photo. I'm a little obsessed. Tra tragedy has struck. I put my chapstick in the washer. That is tragic. I'm so sorry, Curtin. I am so sorry. Do you have a backup? I really hope so. I really hope so because I can't tell you how important chapstick is in this household. 
in this here beehive. Oh, you can't find your Christmas sweater, Plebo? Oh my gosh. Did you put it in storage or something? That's what I usually do. And then I'm like, where is it? And then I find it way too late. I hope you find it though. You need it. Two days. Two days. You gotta find it. Wait, <laughs> Kyle, what did you say? Oh, I closed something I needed. Oh no, I lost. Oh no, there it is. Um, I'm losing my mind. Got to get the three pack curtain. Are your clothes messed up? Oh yeah, did it mess up your clothes curtain? That's a good. That's a good point, Kyle. I always get nervous of that, but it never seems to get on the clothes. But yeah, three packs are life changing. I'm always jealous of girls because of those flavored lip glosses you get, like Coca Cola. Yeah, but they're not actually really good for your lips. Like stuff like that is not actually like super great for you. I feel like. The Tumblr ones. Oh yeah, you're right. Tumblr ones. Definitely has a hack for that. Cute little curtain. Wait. Has a hack for what? The chapstick washer thingy? <laughs> it may be somewhere at my parents' house, if not in the garage. Oh, got you. You better hit them up. It was a giant giraffe on it wearing a Santa hat. Oh, that's cute. I love it. I love it. Wow, it's hot out here. Sure is, buddy. I have an idea. Do you want to go to the beach today? We're going on another date. We've done this one before, I think, though. Cotton bud or what you call a Q-tip, possibly. Oh, I did get the three-pack, thankfully. It just means my car chapstick becomes my main squeeze now. I love that. I'm gl so glad that I'm not the only one who's like, okay, I have my car chapstick and my desk chapstick and my backpack chapstick that stays in there at all times. So no matter where I go, it's in there, which I just used a second ago. I need to get a replenishment pack, though. I don't use them because they are shockingly bad for your lips. Exactly, Patchy. Okay, I'm not wrong. I didn't see what time he told me to go. That's okay. <laughs> I was talking. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. He loves me. He'll wait. Gotta get the medicated stuff, Colorado. -ness. I have to get Aquaphor. Aquaphor is the only thing that actually, like, really works for me. Because I got... I used to get just regular chapstick, and it would do the job, like, kind of fine. But it doesn't do it like Aquaphor does. Like, I did Accutane when I was starting college. Like, my second year of college, I did Accutane. No, my third year of college. And that was the only chapstick that really helped me. Because everything else was just kind of like putting something over just dried lips. Like, Aquaphor would actually help the cause. And then I got really bad dry lips like two years ago, I remember. And I couldn't get like I was suffering and then I got like a huge thing of Vaseline and Aquaphor so I'd put on Aquaphor and then at night I'd put on that and then put <laughs> Vaseline over it and it got rid of the issue in like two days so there's you there you go there's your life hack just saying I just watered the chicken or the duck my bad duck okay everybody oops everybody watch out I'm a farmer on a mission. I hope you're all here to hear when you get married, if you're into that in real life, the pajama stash is unparalleled. What? The pajama stash? For marriage? Well, I don't plan on getting married in real life, but I need to know about this pajama stash. Neutrogena novice over here for, for lip products. I used a Neutrogena like lip gloss once, and I do have to say that was life changing. I lost it, but I do remember like the week that I had it, I loved it. Cause it was hydrating and it made my lips look nice. It was like a lip gloss that was very hydrating. We also call it lip balm here. Lip balm, we do know that. We call it chapstick even though it's like, technically chapstick is like a brand. It's technically supposed to be lip balm, I think. Spider ham, I know I just saw that too midnight. I was like, spider what? I was like, spider ham. <laughs> Is that a mod on the sprinklers to look like that? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It is. Midnight. Sorry. Yeah, it's a mod that makes them look like little little circles. Um, I, ge I genuinely so bad at Stardew, but it's so fun. Do you have any advice on, like, being a better decorator? Um, hiccup, I used to also be very bad. Debatably still am. Um, I would say what made me be a better decorator is going on Pinterest and kind of looking at other ideas, how people did theirs, and just like experimenting on my farm with like a few different, um, like an old farm that I had, I experimented with a few different layouts, like kind of copying them, and then I kind of figured out like, 
okay, that's how you do this and this is how you do that and like figured out the spacing and what I thought was good for my game style and play. And then I essentially kind of built what worked for me and like figured out a layout that I enjoyed. I don't know if that's helpful, but I feel like going off of somebody else's design, at least in the beginning, can be super, super helpful and then just catering it to what you want, you know? I hope that makes sense and I hope that's helpful whatsoever. Did I not get the stuff from inside of the barn in the coop? I guess I didn't. Or maybe I did. Should I marry this girl? Yes, she has a pajama stash. Oh, okay. That's not me. <laughs> I don't feel like that's me. I don't have a pajama stash. I don't. If anything, I've just been stealing a lot of my boyfriend's like shirts and sweatpants lately. And he loves it. He's like, I love when you wear my stuff. And it's nice because then I don't then I don't have to sleep in pants because his clothes are like a dress, you know? So there you go. Um and it's hot here, so we don't wear, I don't wear, I don't really wear, like, pants. I can't wear pajama pants to bed, but we just gave you Iridium. These. I have one statue. So, Midnight, when you hit, is it year, end of year two, when you do, there's, like, a, an event where Grandpa will rate your farm, and he'll give you a statue from it, where it, that makes Iridium, if you haven't gotten there. And we did, somebody told me to finagle it so I could, like, essentially cheat. I don't want to say cheat. It's like you can ha like make something where it gives you multiple statues or multiple of an item. And we did that. And now I have five of them somehow. Thank you, Patchy. Mm -mm -mm. That's how parents get you, Vaseline. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Did I not grab the stuff out of here? I swear I did. Oh, I did. What did I do? What did I do? Glitch and it still works. Yeah, this it's more of a glitch. Thank you, Schmuckledorf. Also, Schmuckledorf. Hello. <laughs> How are you? Good to see you. I was like, I don't want to call it a cheat because it's not really. I guess I don't. I don't know. I don't know. It is a glitch though. They used to be able to do it for like more items too, but now I think it's just that. You said you got the Snoopy ones from your stash. Well. I guess the stash underneath my bed is more of like random clothing pieces that can't be worn at all year. Like I have like a Halloween like denim shirt underneath there. I have costume pieces from like different costumes I've worn for shows or like Halloween. We have a random pair of sheets in there. It's just like a suitcase filled with things. I don't know. It's not a pajama stash though. I've never gotten that far but I'm very close. Yes you are. I was gonna say midnight. I think you're super super close to it if you don't have it already. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Let me go see. I need to get... Um, no, this is not where I need to be. I wanted to... I'm trying to make sure as I go that I'm making most things. Which... Those are all good. I think these are all good. Um, this one we need to make. Oh, this we need to make too. Okay. I thought I made one of those. I guess not. What else? What else? Thinking. Thinking. Crafted one time. I think these are all good. What is this? Friendship bracelet? Since when? Since when can I make that? Can I give it to someone? Can I... This can be used to ask someone to be your platonic roommate? Since you have a... Where did I get this mod from and when? It can be used to ask someone to, you, to be your platonic roommate. Since you have a housemate and can't easily get another... Mermaid's pendant. The recipe has been altered so you can craft it for the achievement. Oh, so I can't get I can't get a roommate anymore. I have a mod that you could get a platonic roommate. <laughs> That's amazing. I didn't know about that. 
Guys love girls that wearing that stuff, especially shirts. All the whining is fake. Exactly. I'll say he likes when I wear stuff. Yeah, sorry, boys. That was good. I confused. I confused myself. Minnesota Molly and Colorado Curtain. Exactly. Except for right now, I'm California Molly. I wish I was Minnesota Molly. I love Minnesota. Thought of it again. Still pisses me off. Everyone hates Grampleton Orange Chicken except Sophia and Marnie. I don't even know what that is, Bogart. Is that in the expanded? Marnie dislikes it and Sophia loves it. Never will not piss me off. Oh, gosh. Mountains in peace. I miss the mountains. <gasps> I didn't tell you guys. I bought a ticket and I'm going back to January. I mean, going back to January. <laughs> I'm going back to Colorado in January. I'm so excited. Watch her give it to Penny. No. I don't think I can give it to anybody to make them move in. I think I just have to build it for completion. Hmm. I hope you go back to Minnesota soon. Me too. I hope I do. But I'm going to Colorado in January and I'm so excited. I'm so excited. It was my dad's uh, Christmas present to me, which was too, too nice. Yeah, Kyle, did you not know about that? I better see you. Um... But yes, I'm going back to Colorado in January, and I'm super excited because I have a week off from work, so I'm going to go spend time with some family, and I'm not going this time for, like, any sort of special, like, event, you know what I mean? Like, my brother being home, for those of you who don't know, my brother lives in Japan, um, and then when I went in July, I think, like, right before I started streaming, I went home to Colorado, um... And it was just, it's its stressful when you have a lot of things like that you're doing because then it's like, okay, I have to see all these people and we have to do all these events and get all this stuff done. So when you just have nothing to do, it's going to be super chill. It'll be nice. Selk Studio? I hope I'm saying that right. Welcome in. Thank you so much for the follow. Your name is super cool. But welcome in. Welcome in. Ayla! I finally have my house back. It was nice seeing friend, family such friends, but having people in the house for over three weeks straight is exhausting. Oh God, Ayla, that sounds like a lot. But hello, welcome in. I was just thinking about you before I started stream. So good to see you. How's everything else other than not ha finally getting your house back? I'm sure that feels nice. Your dad is the real MVP. MVP. I know he is. He's my favorite person. I love him so much. He's amazing. I'm so excited. I know, Curtin. I can't wait to see you. I'm super excited. Thanks, Patchy. Yeah, I'm I'm disturbingly excited. Disturbingly excited. Um, I wonder what January is like. What are the popular tourist sites? What's the climate like, JK? In Colorado? It'll be definitely interesting to go home and be in cold weather. I wonder if it'll snow while I'm there. That'll be a concept. I can finally use my big winter jacket again. I love my winter jacket, and there's no need to wear it here. So, so many nice places in Japan. Suddenly, wow, I know. <laughs> Yeah, he's lived in Japan, oh my god, for so long now. He just got married two years ago? He got two, married two years ago, but yeah, he loves it. I'm probably going to Japan next summer, and I'm so excited. <gasps> Curtain, like in 2023? Is that like next summer, like 2023 summer? That's amazing. Should I save up and we can go together? I'm just kidding. I know you're going to see your dad. I'm so happy that's... Wait. That's what you've wanted. Sorry, I'm late. I was budgeting. No, you're okay, Midnight. I know. I really, my co-teacher, my lead teacher asked me if I was going back to Colorado today because she thought maybe I was um, going home for Christmas, but I was like, nope, we're going to go and do it in um, January because it makes more sense. Ooh, I changed the time. Um, I had an eggnog dirty chai today and I've gotten, gotten literally nothing but played Kingdom Hearts 2 after work. Oh, that sounds amazing though, Ayla. Also, did you eat? Did you eat something other than just drinking your dirty chai? I hope so. I hope so. But that sounds like a good day. I really want eggnog. I should have gotten some earlier. Puffy jacket, Molly. Exactly. I love puffy jackets. It's just like a big black puffy jacket. Um, I heard 60 degrees in California is like negative 40 for me, basically. Basically, since I'm always cold. It is hot right now in my room, though. I should have turned on the, the air conditioner. Uh, I wanted to see this rainy day gear that... Pierre brought up, but maybe it only is in here when it rains? I don't see it. He lied to me. He lied. Oh, wait, Joe or a different brother? My other brother. So, oh, Joe, you didn't, is my my older brother, my oldest brother. He lives in Colorado. Um, There is another person, his his username, if you've ever seen him, him in here, it's Akabeko. I think that's how you say it, Akabeko. And um, that's my brother, Matt. And he's the one who lives in Japan. 
My brother told me yesterday he's thinking of proposing to his girlfriend of seven years this year. <gasps> Curtain, stop. You're joking. That's so exciting. Oh my god. That made me disturbingly excited. You have to tell me. Does he know like when? When in the year? I almost cried. I don't blame you. That's amazing. Does he know when he's going to try to do it? Oh, how cute. I had hot chocolate pa hot chocolate pancakes. Chocolate pancakes with mini marshmallows, whipped cream, and peppermint sauce. Oh, wow. Ayla, that sounds good. I mean, I wouldn't know because I can't have it. But I'm sure it was delicious. Sounds like a good combo. And a turkey sandwich. It wasn't all sugar. <laughs> well, good, Ayla. But good. I was just making sure you ate because I was like, you've only had eggnog today? No. No, no, no. Unbalanced? I love you. I like your name too. Hi, hello, welcome in. How are you doing? Oh my god, good for curtains, brother. Seven years, holy crud. I know. Isn't it like basically if you're together for more than for seven years, isn't that like common law marriage? Are you technically like married? Not that like I'm saying that that's enough because it's. I know. I I totally get wanting to be married and make it official, but um, am I wrong or am I right about that? My boyfriend and I do not want to get married, but we know we want to be together. Like, that's kind of our thing. We're like, we, we plan to be together for, like, ever, but we just don't want to get married. Um, and my dad, like, he supports that, but he gets a little nervous. He's like, well, if one of you goes in the hospital or something happens, like, and you guys don't live here, he can't go in there because he's not your spouse or family. Like, they wouldn't let him in. So it's like, oh. all this romance everywhere and Penny's still single. Boys, stop it. Don't make me feel bad. I already feel terrible. Let's see what our hearts are at with Penny. We're at six now. Six hearts with Penny. We're almost to perfection with her. And I think, did that say I gave Sandy all her gifts? Yes. I need to get some of the obelisks. Should I just do one right now? Should we spring for one? Like one of the 500,000 ones? I think that's right, huh? Um... That's longer than I've been in St Sitka, and that felt like forever. Oh my gosh. Not all states do common law. Yeah, that's true. I didn't think so. They were high school sweethearts. They've been together since they were like 16. Oh my god. That's crazy to think about, Curtin. I remember, didn't you and I go and pick him up from school once? That is so crazy to think about, because I just remember like seeing him and us picking him up. Oh my god. Thinking about him in high school is wild. Because they've been together basically as long as you and I have been besties. Wowza. How's that? How's that? I've been single forever and I'm four years older than him. I was so, I'm so resigned to be the cool single idiot at holidays. No, I'll come and we're going to be the cool Boston marriage aunts. You know what I mean? Boston marriage. I'll never let it go. Dr. Taylor is sitting somewhere just being like, those stupid girls. <laughs> I taught them what a Bostonian marriage is once, and now they won't let it go. Oh. Smart dad too. Minnesota allows the non-spouse. Does it? I don't know. Maybe it does. It doesn't make things very iffy if there's a medical emergency for sure, but if not, if you're not comfortable, you aren't comfortable. It would absolutely be worth getting paperwork with a lawyer stating each other's wishes regarding end of life planning so you're covered. That's a good point, Ayla. That is a very good point. I should do that probably. I know we, we, he, my dad always is like, if you get married, the benefits. And that really is something that sometimes Trevor and I are like, yeah. Yeah, that's true. Not, not to be rude, but your child's name is Florence. Yeah, we thought it was kind of like, we thought it was a name that Sebastian would enjoy, Patchy. We thought it would be a name that he'd enjoy. Like Florence and the Machines, very like angsty, like emo-ish. Not emo, they're not emo, but like angstiness. I don't know. It seemed right. And I think we were all slightly thinking of our huge crush on Florence Pugh, right? Because I know I have one. I have a crush on her. Queenie? Queenie Spades? Is that it? Hello! Oh my gosh! Oh my god, the raid message is so cute! Hear ye, hear ye. Queenie's raid has arrived to deliver thee with wholesome vibes. Stop. That is so cute. <laughs> Hello. Thank you so much for the raid. Oh my goodness. This is so cute. 
Oh my god. Wait. Oh my god, I feel like I'm going to say your name wrong. Is it Sheeler? I think that's right. I most definitely watch your streams. <laughs> I think I'm still following you. If I'm not, I need to refollow. No, I am. I'm definitely still following you. I watch your streams and I love you very much. Oh my gosh. Hello, everybody. Welcome in. Hi, thank you so much. No, thank you, Queenie. I really appreciate the raid. Let me give you a nice little shout out. What were you guys up to? I feel so honored. Oh, you guys are playing Stardew Valley t as well. Hello, hello. It's Toasted Letty. Hello. Toasted Letty. <laughs> what were you guys doing in Stardew? Oh my gosh, hello. My cheeks hurt. I was acting a fool in Stardew. What, what does that mean? I'm following you, by the way, because I'd like to come see how you're acting a fool. Oh, at 51% per percent perfection. That's amazing. Oh, Queenie, thank you so much for the follow. Oh, my God. I'm such a loser. Oh, my gosh. I think voice left. I don't like your voice. I think left. Oh, my gosh. The raid is so cute. Oh, oh, thank you so much for the for the follows. Unbalanced. And is, is it... Is it Sheeler? I realize I've never found out how to say it, but I know that I come and watch your streams and enjoy the cozy vibes all the time. But welcome in. I'm going to give you a shout out too because you guys should check out the stream. It's pure cozy vibes. Nice chill time. And I typed it in wrong. <laughs> Please ignore me. Please ignore me. I'm flustered. Life is great. We all know I'm not good at raids. We all know how I get. Food and drink. Is that right? Food and drink? Okay, hopefully I typed it wrong. I passed out and then I was supposed to go to Junior Island and I forgot I don't have the obelisk. Oh no! Sheeler. Yes, exactly like that. Sheeler. Okay, hopefully I said it right that time too. Well, thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate you guys. I feel so honored. Food and drink is cooking streams. <gasps> you were doing a cooking stream? I was just talking about with the um, another one of our lovely people in our community followers, Vendable Foot. That I'd really like to do a baking stream sometime. Oh, you did a baking stream for your birthday. Well, happy belated birthday. That's amazing. What did you make? Is it Addo Beard? I hope I'm saying that right. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Yes, you're saying it, Sheila, right? Thank you. She's the best. It was her birthday on Wednesday. Yes, happy belated birthday. That's so amazing. That's so cool to do a baking, a baking stream on your birthday. Maybe did you make yourself a cake? You did bake a cake. Okay, super cool. What kind of cake did you make? I'm horrible at baking cakes. So those are the ones that I normally stay away from. I'm also terrible at frosting cakes, I've realized. It's a very difficult thing. Love lurking in Sheila's streams. Yeah, I, I do all the time because I'm just like, it's so cozy here. I like that I just put the vibes on in the background and then it makes me want to play some cozy games as well. So I'm um, a little too excited. <laughs> A little too excited. But yeah, we're just working on, in our start day right now, we're just working on perfection. Just kind of making money. And I'm trying to work up the nerve to buy an obelisk right now. Because I'm, I don't want to spend money. But I know I need to. And also, I need to. And we have lots of mods on. I don't know if anybody's against mods. I understand if you are. But right now, we are trying to grind this ancient fruit life. Because hopefully it'll give us all the money we need. I'm not always the best at like making sure I have kegs going and grinding the wine. But I've, I've, I've been turned into the, not the dark side, but like people have shined a light on some of the best ways to make money. And this, here we are. I just realized I never went to my date with Sebastian yesterday either. He didn't seem upset. I don't think, at least. Sorry, Seb. Sorry, Seb. Ooh, midnight. I'm so sorry. That does not sound like fun. Sheila, because I... Oh, oh, oh. Sorry. Cozy vibes gets me through my workday. Exactly. Especially when I used to work from home. Always watched cozy streams during the workday. They were so nice. But they really do help. They get the time going. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh, the little turtle. That's right, because the theme is turtles on your thing. Oh my goodness. Are you going for perfection too? I have mods also. They're the best. Okay, that makes me feel better, because I was like, I feel like some people come in and they're like, oh, 
look at all your mods. And I'm like, huh, sorry. Um, I am going for perfection. I don't know what we're at now. I think we're at like 80 something maybe. Noff, thank you so much for the resubscription. Five months. Oh my God. That is wild. <laughs> thank you so much. So glad to see you, friend. So glad to see you. Boom. I like the message with it. Just says boom. Amazing. When is Tim going to England again? Tim is leaving on Monday, the 26th. That's when he's going to England. So I will be alone. I work remote and that's all I do. Perfect. That's so perfect, Letty. Honestly, it's, it's like having entertainment and somebody there, but it's just chill, you know? It always gets me through, too. Join us wineries. Yes, only... One more step and you will have half your greenhouse star fruit to maximize profit. I know we we have all of our oh yeah, that's right. Star fruit's a good way to go too. I should buy more because right now on the island we have star fruit going, but I need it to sell it for the sake of um that completion where you have to sell like fifteen of every crop, I believe. Yeah. Oh we had a raid. <laughs> yes, we did, Bogart. We did. Welcome, welcome back. You have us? Yeah, I do have you guys. That's true. Girl, mod it up. They make the game so much easier to play. They do. And also, the aesthetics. How can I be upset? Like, I love the aesthetics of the mods. Especially, like, I always say this, but, like, the earthly retone. Like, the earthly tones that they do. Okay, that's not exactly what it is. Earthly recolor. That's what it's called, I believe. And that makes a huge difference for me. I don't mind the original colors, but they're just so bright. So I really love when it's more muted and it makes the game definitely feel a lot more cozy for me. I love this game, but anything to make it even cozier. And easier. Honestly. There's just some things that I need. I don't want to walk all the way back for my, you know, watering can sometimes. That's just the lazy kind of gal I am. Hi TK, welcome in! How are you? Good to see you. Wait, are those flowers in a barn a part of a barn mod? Yes, I think it's called like cuter barn and coops. I have a mod list here. My stream freaks out when I switch screens. I made a document of some of the mods. I need to update it, so hopefully it's on there. But the the flowers in the barn, it's like a cuter barn and coop or something like that. It's really adorable. It's really adorable. Oh, Ayla, it's okay. Thank you for being a real one though and also linking it. You're amazing. I'm doing well, TK. How are you? I agree, Ayla. It is a must. It is a must. Is the farm layout modded? It's so flat with no cliffs. It's all in one area. No, I have the, um, I'm on the forest farm midnight, so that's why that layout is that way. That's why it is. <laughs> Bogart, your message is amazing. Presents are wrapped, so off to bed for me. Have a good night and a good holiday weekend. You too, Kyle. Congrats on finishing your present wrapping, but have a good night, get some good sleep, and be safe driving to Nebraska tomorrow. Thanks for stopping in. Good, TK. I'm do glad you're doing well. Are you getting ready for your holidays? All the fun stuff? Ayla, don't apologize. You're perfect. You're perfect. You're perfect. I appreciate your help. I really do. All right, we got tons of wine. Look at me. If college was here, she'd be proud. I like to think. She's like my mom. I have to make her proud. Make her proud of all my wine grinding. Please pick these up. Please pick these up. There we go. So that'll be a good chunk of change again, right? I need to make more kegs. I really do. Which means I probably need to go cut down some more trees. Oh, TK, how exciting! Are you doing anything special tomorrow? Like, are you going to go exchange gifts with anybody? I only have my boyfriend. We're going to go celebrate our four-year anniversary tomorrow. That's what we're doing. Four-year anniversary. And for the four-year anniversary slash Christmas, he got me tickets to go see Mean Girls, the musical. For those of you who don't know, I'm a big theater fan. I love musical theater. So we're going to go see Mean Girls. So I'm super excited. I'll just check it out. Thank you for the link. Of course, Queenie. Hopefully it's helpful. I'm, I'm sure you have some of them on there already. But if there's any that you ever see that you don't, you can always check them out there. Off topic, what I was planning on doing my first stream soon. Do you have any tips? Unbalanced, of course. Um, well, that's super exciting. You're going to do your first stream. But I would say have bribe your friends to be in there. <laughs> or, you know, like ask people to be in there. Um, 
I had my sister and my best friend, Curtin, who is currently one of my moderators in there when I first streamed. And they just helped me like check my levels on things and just general um, idea of like if things were okay. And gave me people to talk to. But I guess even if you don't have people that like brightly there to talk to, just keep talking and make up, like literally talk about anything and just be in it and enjoy yourself because if you're talking, people admire that I feel like because even if there's zero people in there and you're talking, people are like, wow, okay, this person's chill and they're, they're tr making it work. Um, and also don't be hard on yourself if anything goes wrong. Um, when I first started streaming, I was, and even now these days, I get like, if something goes wrong, I'm so embarrassed. And then I watch other people's streams where things will go wrong and I'm like, no, you're perfect. We're just enjoying the vibes, et cetera, et cetera. And I'm like, if I feel that way towards other people when mistakes happen, I think that my community probably understands when I mess something up or make mistakes. Um, so I'd say just, just chill and play a game that you wanna play and so that you enjoy what you're streaming and it's not like painful for you. So just, you know, relax, enjoy your game. Have, try to have a, maybe like one or two people in there that you know so you can just like kind of get a feel for it. I don't know. I hope that was helpful. I know we have other streamers in the chat too. So if you guys have any advice, please, please give it. Low on money. So I've been doing some crafting and organizing some other stuff. Oh, that's awesome, TK. Oh my gosh, MQ. Thank you for the three biddies. Three biddies. I appreciate you. I hope your concert's going well if you're still there. Also, Sleviticus, thank you for the hydrate. I have boba here, not water. So... I'm drinking that. And also, thank you for the stretch. I need to catch up on chat now. Crafting smart, though, TK. I usually make people scarves. I knit scarves when I'm in that predicament. I'm wondering what I'll get for Christmas considering how I've been. I doubt I'll get anything. No, Bogart. I'm sure you'll get stuff. You're amazing. If you hold click, it is... If you hold click, it is quicker. Oh, did, like, pick things off? Is that what you're saying? I'm so behind. Oh, hang with your sisters and nieces. That sounds like a nice chill. Christmas, TK. Sounds like per perfection. Perfection. I need to put these things away. Okay, I'm gonna give Penny one of these. Oh, wait, I'll keep you. Come back. The rest we keep. I think. <laughs> oh, wait, no, we don't. No, I'll figure it out in a second. Crafting, gems, farm, oh wait, go back, go back, summer crops, except for you, you get to stay, I keep forgetting it's raining, I want to go to Piers though and see if this is true that it's, if when it rains the stuff is there, Santa's always watching, he is, thank you for the happy anniversaries by the way, I'm super excited. Tilly didn't forget to say that. Oh, yeah, I died to some wooden spikes. If anyone was wondering what embarrassing, absurd death I had. Oh, no. Oh, no. Hello, hello. I'm mainly just a lurker on Twitch, but just want to say hi and thank you for the amazing vibes you bring to your streams. <gasps> thank you, Odinata. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Sorry, I missed your message a little bit. I'm catching up on chat, but I hope you're still here. But thank you so much. I'm so glad to hear that they're good vibes. And um, I'm glad to have people like you who are just make the stream amazing by bringing such lovely energy as well. Amgu, how is the concert? You're finally back. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay, I'm balanced. I'm glad that helps. I'm really, I'm really glad. I agree with the chatting part. Never stop talking. Narrate everything you do because it keeps people entertained and fun. Yeah, it feels a little awkward sometimes, but like it's super, people are like, oh, this is funny. Like my brother, I remember I came into a stream late the first time he streamed and his narration just like had me cracking up. Like he didn't even know I was there at first. So he was just talking. It was so funny. I did get jump scared by some fire next to our seats though. It was awesome. Oh my gosh, I am you. Good jump scare. Keep you on your toes. Make sure you're still awake during the concert. It sounds amazing though. I can wholeheartedly confirm that things can and do go wrong on stream. It's hard, but don't let it get to you. You can overcome it. Plus you can use any type of technical difficulties as a way to connect with your chat. True. That is very true. But like I said, yeah, people are very understanding. You always just assume, like, because you see so many, like, horror stories, I feel like, sometimes that, like, people are not going to be understanding. But, like, when you have a good community to um, fall back on or just, like, like, the Stardew community, people who are gaming this. <gasps> Look at 
rain stuff. Should we put it on? Oh my goodness. Look at me. I'm in a little rain outfit. <laughs> but yeah, when you play a good game with a good community behind it, I think it really helps too. Honestly. Gay Bagels for Everyone. I love that name. That is absolutely amazing. Welcome in. Thank you so much for the follow. Thank you. Thank you. Glad to have you here. Good night. I'm so glad I found nice new starter streamers to enjoy. Oh, Hiccup, thank you so much. Have a great night. Sorry I missed your message before, but get some good sleep. Have a good night. Oh my gosh. Making conversation over anything tends to be a good skill overall, so it's good to know how to do it. Exactly. I never just shut up, so that's how I get by. And luckily, people are like, oh, she's so good at talking during stream. I'm like, this is just me voicing every thought in my head. Oh, I did not get enough. I don't think. I have to go back. I have to go back. Oh, oh, oh. Me and my little rain gear. We're so cute. Word vomit. That's me at all times. The rain fit is cute. Isn't it, Amgu? It's adorable. I'm obsessed. Maybe I did get enough. Oh, yeah. It was just right there. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. Char type? I hope I'm saying that right. Welcome in. Thank you so much for the follow. Glad to have you here. Welcome. Gay Bagel, I really like this egg that you just put as an emote. That's amazing. Amazing. Also, I got a beanie. And you from the, from who you saw you did? You think I'm understanding news to me? I do sexiness, actually. You're very good at helping with technical issues, too. Just saying. Just saying. No raindrop will ever touch you. I know. My legs are kind of bare, but it kind of it's kind of a fit. It's kind of cute. OMG, I love that name. The gay bagels one. Patchy. <laughs> it is super cute. Oh, my gosh. Trans-Siberian Orchestra. I I've, I feel like I've listened to Trans-Siberian Trans Orchestra before. You should get the umbrella mod. I know. I was thinking the same thing. I was like, now I just need an umbrella. Also, the name reminds me of another user that wouldn't buy something out of the lines of, we're out of blueberry bagels. <laughs> were they in here, Bogart? I don't think I've seen that. Yes, you got it right. Thanks. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Char Type. Glad to have you here. I'm glad I got it right. I always like to make sure, but welcome in. All right, Molly, I'm going to head. I hope you head out. I hope you have a great night. You too, Queenie. Thank you so much for the raid and the follow. You're amazing. Um, but have a good night. Get some good sleep. And I will definitely be checking out and coming into your stream. So I appreciate you very, very much. But get some good sleep. Happy holidays. Okay, so, guys. I, what, what's my purpose is making money right now. I'm like a machine. Zella Uno. Hope I'm saying that right. Zella Uno. Welcome in. Thank you so much for the follow. Glad to have you here. Okay. My purpose right now is to get wood. I don't eat bagels. But bagels are so good. <laughs> you don't eat bagels. Oh my goodness. But they're still out there somewhere. However, I can munch on some gay bagels for everyone specifically. What is a gay bagel? Somebody tell me. Somebody tell me right now. You said it right. Okay, good. Thank you, Zella Uno. How are you doing? Glad to have you here. Thank you, and Merry Christmas. Happy holidays, everyone. Thanks, Queenie. Oh my gosh. What year are you on? I am on year four. I'm slacking a little bit, I feel like, but we are on year four. Slowly but surely making it happen. I have a few okay videos from the concert I can drop in the Discord if you want. Please do, MQ. I'd love to see. I want to see this fire and all that jazz you were talking about as well. I need to get the vibes. I need to see it for myself. Don't feel pressured, though. But I would like to see. <laughs> Don't look it up. Just <laughs> as a precaution. I'll take your word for it. I will not look it up. I think that's good advice. I think that's very good advice. Oh, gosh. Thank you, Midnight, for sharing the Discord. I appreciate you. Cutting down the trees. Cutting down the trees. As soon as I do this every time, that's when I get the request from, from Robin that's like, I'll give a reward to anybody who gets a thousand wood this week. And then I have no trees to cut down. That's how it happens. I gotta give an FLC sheet. Oh, thank you, MQ. That's very helpful. Yes. That's very true. Deforestation, deforestation. I know, I'm the problem. I'm so sorry. I guess I could go spend all my money at Robin's and just buy wood. Look at the hat mouse. He looks different. I could be a cat. <laughs> I already own all the hats, technically, so I guess I don't need them. Hi, Izzy. Thank you for the heart, Izzy. Cutie patootie. 
My cheeks hurt. After that amazing raid and so many lovely people, I've been smiling too much. I need to calm down. I need to calm down. <laughs> okay, after this, I'm going to make more kegs. I also need to make sure I have all the ingredients for this Tom Tom Kai soup. I hope I'm saying that right. I really hope so. But I need to make sure I have all the ingredients for it. Oh, I'm stuck on a rock. Alright, alright, alright. I'm obsessed with this outfit. I just want it to rain every single day so I can be a cutie in my little rain outfit. What am I going to do when it stops raining? I look like Georgie. Uh-oh. This might be a bad idea, actually. But look at me. <laughs> I'm starting to look like six. From, um, Little Nightmares. I almost said spirited away. That's so wrong. So I'm doing a playthrough of this game, and my goals are to marry and divorce everyone, including Krobus. Oh my gosh. How many people have you married so far? Gay bagel. <laughs> How many people have you married so far? I was thinking about doing that in this playthrough, because I'm like, okay, listen, we've already married Penny, and we divorced her. Should we just keep it going? And I was like, I don't think I could take it. I don't think my heart could take it. So the word was today's stream would be longer. What's the potential time frame? It might not be longer. Just letting you know, midnight. Because your girl is still sick. And I started later than I wanted to. So we shall see. We shall see. Um, but we're just going. Also, Tim the Milkman was like, we were talking earlier. And he's like, are we going to watch a Christmas movie tonight? Because when I tell you, when we put up our Christmas tree on like December 2nd, he was like, we should, uh, we were like, we're going to watch so many Christmas movies. We're going to like really make it happen. And now we're sitting here like, we didn't watch a single Christmas movie this entire season. So kind of failed at that, but we'll see. I'm going to go. I'm tired, but you seem really cool and chill streamer. I will 100% be returning unbalanced. Thank you so much. If you're still here, I'm also going to drop you a follow because you said you were going to do some streaming, hopefully. Um, so if you do stream, I will try to make it to your stream and be in the chat and give you some support. Wander by the sewer that is near the graveyard and wait for Pennywise. Oh my God, you're so right. Only four. Abigail, Leah, Penny, and Haley. Dang, but that's a lot of people you've worked through already. How many... How many bachelors are there technically? I'm sorry, I'm in the clouds. <laughs> Is you're okay? I am sick. I'm a little sick. I'm a little congested right now, but it's okay. It's okay. We're chilling. I hope you don't overwork yourself though. Thank you, MQ. I know everybody was so nice in the Discord yesterday when you guys were understanding that I I did not feel well yesterday. Because like I said when I started stream tonight that we had a lot of people out this week because three people tested positive for COVID. Um... And they're all people that I work very closely with. Thankfully, I, I've tested myself multiple times. I don't have it. Um, but I always get nervous because I'm like, maybe it's too early to tell. Um, but I did wear a mask at work just in case. And I made sure I was safe. Um, and so far, so good. I mean, I feel a little off, but I think I'm also just really tired. You know what I mean? I don't know. Sorry, I haven't slept for a while. I don't remember if you asked something. Zella Uno, I think I just asked how you were. But you're okay. You're okay. Self-care, you need it. I know. I'm really bad at doing self-care. Christmas. Yes. <laughs> oh. No more overnighters. That's true. That's true. I've watched Fra Christmas Vacation about five times in the last week. It's Leviticus by choice. Why? I want to watch that one. I love Christmas Vacation. I need to watch it really bad. There are probably around four, seven spouses, so that's closer to 350k minimum. Holy moly. Hey, hi, hello, and how are ya? Is there enough hellos? How are you peeps doing? Hi, Doc Machina. Welcome in. That was the perfect amount of hellos. Glad to have you here. How are you doing? I'm doing well. Please have mercy on me. Please get Midnight out of my head so I can refer to Midnight as a human being and not some rabid ghost spark hunter. I don't know what that means, Bogart. Oh, see, I won't. What? Oh, 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 I get it. I get it. How to be sick and look fine. Do I look fine? I literally, before I started stream, I was like, should I stream? And I was sitting here, Tim the Milkman was in here with me, and I was like, I don't know, should I stream? And I'm like, it all depends on if I look semi-acceptable before I start stream. And I looked at myself, and I was like, I don't think I look all that great, but we're going to do it anyway because I miss everybody. <laughs> so here we are. Oh, my God. More importantly, which is what? which is she named Midnight of All Things. Oh, gosh. Bogart, what is that from? 
Random Molly fact, Patchy. Oh, golly. <gasps> Look at all that money. Wine. Wine. Oh, Patchy asks, what's your favorite animal? My favorite animal is red pandas. Is a red panda. I love red pandas. Um, and ducks. Ducks are like my second favorite animal, but I'll tell you what, red pandas... I just don't think they're actually real. I've seen them with my own eyes, but I think they're robots. Because there's, there's no way something can be that cute. Like, you know what I mean? It's just... Have you seen red pandas play in the snow? It's fake. <laughs> Sorry for the constant ranting of midnight. No, you're okay, Bogart. I just don't understand. Ambu, you are not new. I meant to redeem hydrate. I still have my boba here. Oh, the pool scene. Oh, God. Gay bagels. Wait. Being, being cautious queen? I am a cautious queen. Well, especially because I don't want to get Trevor sick. He's about to go to England. Could you imagine if I had COVID and I gave it to him? He wouldn't be able to go. I'd feel so bad. I'd feel so, so bad. Just a casual 250 grand. I know. I thought it was more than that, but it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. The sweater's cute. Thank you. If you mean this one. I'm so glad it's raining again today so I can keep wearing my cute little rain outfit. I'm adorable. <laughs> my favorite animals are bagels. Why do I just imagine you having like a bagel for a pet? And like on a leash and just walking it around town. That's all I imagine. Christmas Vacation is the best Christmas movie. It really is. It's so good. I do enjoy The Grinch though. I do enjoy watching The Grinch. And I really love Jingle All The Way. I've mentioned it before. I'll mention it again. I love Jingle All The Way. Yes, slay the winery. Slay them. I know, Patchy. I'm trying. I am trying. I'm trying. I'm the cute Molly. I'm that cute Molly. What do you mean, Bagel? I'm so confused. Capybara is underrated. Oh, capybaras are pretty cute. There's a guy on TikTok who owns capybaras, and they're adorable. There's a new game I found recently that's super cute and chill, and you play as Red Panda. Excuse me? What is this game called, Amgu? Tell me right now. I must know. I must know. I, need, I still need to play Stray so I can be a little cat. I want to be a little cat. Who are Trevor and Tim? Trevor slash Tim. So my boyfriend's name is Trevor, but his name on twitch when he decides to come in and hang out with us his username is tim the milkman and i always ask him i'm like why tim the milkman and he's like i just thought it sounded funnier than trevor <laughs> so i call him trevor but then some people don't know who i'm talking about so then i'll also refer to him as tim the milkman he's my partner he is my partner so there you go jingle all the way is the best it's crime that Arnold only made one Christmas movie. I know. And it's so underrated. Like, I bring it up to so many people. They're like, I have no idea what that is. <laughs> Speaking of Tim the Milkman, he's... No, no, no. Not this one. <laughs> Tim the Milkman is here. He got really excited. I was talking about him and jumped in the doorway. But then he let in the demon cat. For those of you who don't know, I have two cats. Murphy and Finch. Murphy's fine when she comes in. Finch likes to harass. And he likes to step on my computer power button every single time. Even when I try to cover it up, he still manages to step on it. And he really loves Stardew. That might sound weird. He really loves Stardew. He likes to watch my person move around. He just, it gets his attention when I'm like walking around. And so he'll start attacking the screen. So he's not allowed to stay in here. Stray is game of the year, Molly. Is it really? I didn't know that. Well, now I definitely need to play. I definitely need to play Stray. The Red Panda game is called Aka, which is Japanese for red. Oh my gosh. Hopefully I said that right. I'll have to check it out. Is it on Steam? I like Vaquitas. They're cute little animal. Am I saying that right? Vaquitas? Do I know what that is? My pet bagel is named Smelvin. I took him on a walk. Oh my god, I'm getting lost. I took him on a walk through the snow today. Did he enjoy it? Did Smelvin enjoy the the snow oh my gosh because old people joke that their kid looks like a milkman smart fellow exactly i think he just wanted to be the milkman the milkman and do all the stuff trevor the tim tam ah yes <laughs> tim tim the milk trevor man <laughs> why is that so funny he needs a new name now he needs to go on and switch his name to that i love it hi malzy sully for lurking i'm gonna have to leave so i have bandwidth to download stuff no worries propel have a good night 
Love you so much. Um, enjoy downloading and getting some new stuff. But have a good night. No worries ever for lurking or having to leave. I give up. Check other games in Discord. I will, Bogart. Okay. I'll take him off your hands. Wait, are you going to take my cat or Tim the milkman? Okay, who just see who I'm talking about? Bogart, why am I nervous? What do you mean? My demon cat loves ketchup chips. He'll do anything to eat a ketchup chip. Innermost hat, what the heck? Ketchup chips, really? I hate ketchup. <laughs> that is so funny. That's how Finch feels about Ritz crackers. He got a taste for one of them, and now every time I have them, he'll, he'll steal them. It's so rude. But ketchup chips? That's hilarious to me. I can put these in here. I'm so focused. Why do I have so many eggs? <laughs> Gets upset over having eggs. Okay. Groovy. Groovy, groovy, groovy. All the eggs. Whoa, that was a lot. Um, and I just have a surplus of truffles, but we won't talk about that. You, you stay, you, gems, crafting, groovy, 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 bye-bye, let's go see Petty, let's go see Petty, you can do the recorder solo anytime you need, by the way, oh, I forgot about the recorder solo, should we stop and do the recorder solo, <laughs> okay, <laughs> for those of you who don't know, for anybody new here, I, um, I'm an amateur um, recorder player. Here it is. Ta-da! I have my recorder. Is it off? No, it's okay. It's on Steam. Don't worry. Okay, I will look into it. Propel, I totally forgot. Bye, bye, Propel. Okay, hopefully I'll have to I'll have to clip this and send it to Propel. I keep hearing Trevor and thinking we're talking about me. Sorry, TK. I'm so sorry for juking you. I'll have to say Tim the Milkman. Yeah, you're saying the right. They're a little dolphin, sadly. Oh! Oh, I think I know what you're talking about. Oh, my goodness. I, I just realized that. Also, Amg, you said hydrate. I'm so lost. There's so much happening. How about both? Hmm? Must like nacho-flavored nachos? Ew. Nacho-flavored nachos sound gross. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I think you can get ketchup chips in the United States as well. Ranch soda? Stay psych right now. Drink any kind of alcohol. My cat starts to fiend for it. Your cat is a definitely a demon. Ransom is real. Oh no, technology has gone too far. Ew. Ew. Looking for the vinegar and the ketchup. The vinegar and the ketchup? Recorder solo. Yes, we play the recorder here. Sorry, I'm trying to catch up. Family friendly streamer. I watched it, tried some, and reaction was it was disgusting. Oh no. Yes, ketchup chips don't really taste like ketchup. They are a little sweeter than salt and vinegar, though. Oh. See, but I'm not very much a sweet person. That's why I don't like ketchup. Ketchup has sugar. Ugh. I think I played one of those in first grade. I played this in fifth grade. Not this specific one, but it looked a lot like it. It looked a lot like it. If tomatoes are fruit, is ketchup juice? <laughs> That's a good question. Somebody get me an answer. Please shut up, Ad. Oh my God, fruit over smoothie. You don't want to eat a. You don't want to drink a smoothie. You just want to eat fruit. Oh my goodness, look at my hair. I'm not doing okay. Who said I looked fine? You were lying. <laughs> Over, thank goodness. Okay. Knowledge is knowing that ketchup is a fruit. Wisdom is knowing that ketchup isn't a smoothie. Ugh. Ew. Ew. Stop it. I think I'm going to cut out of here after the recorder. Bye. Bye, gay bagel. Um, I don't know what to play. <clears throat> I play the same things every time. Here, I'll do a... <laughs> you see my face just fall? Here. Um, we always say hot cross buns. I can play hot cross buns. Ready? I haven't played this in so long. I only play it on stream anymore. I used to, like, literally practice. And it was ridiculous. Ready? By memory. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Is that so impressive? I can do that by memory. I can do this one. I'm not. I can't do this one very well.
there we go. <laughs> That's as far as I'm going. Oh my gosh. Hi, Gore. Hello. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. Play a concert F. I want to hear it on a recorder. I don't even know. I don't even know. I just came in and I'm having horror flashbacks. I, I helped sixth graders learn the recorder and band. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I like your name. Fam lit lit fam off. Fam, is it oof or off? Well, welcome in. I'm so sorry for um, triggering you. Should be, should be just open. <coughs> like that. Is that awful? I'm so sorry. Only dogs can hear that. Ketchup is not quite a condiment nor quite a sauce. Therefore, depending on the liquid content, I feel like it's best to describe it as a, either a soup or a dip. I hate ketchup. I hate ketchup so much. This is disgusting. Just call me Moof. That is so cute. Okay. Moof. Yes and yes. Okay. Well, there you go. There's my song. I also can play this one. We enjoy listening to this one, I think, sometimes. Let me... I haven't, rec I haven't um, practiced this. I'd say it's a dip then. Ugh. Okay, bye-bye now. Bye, gay bagel. Have a good night. Thank you for being here. Ready? I always F it up the first time we play it. three recorder solos not just one three and I totally feel bad that I forgot to do them earlier when Propel was actually here um so I'll have to get those I'll find clips and I'll send them to them because they deserve to hear their lovely recorder solos let's go back to this let's go back take it back take it way way back mmm ocean soup I hate everything about that and hot dogs are a sandwich <laughs> Oh, no. Isn't that weird to think about hot dog as a taco? Yeah, I was going to say, hot dogs seem more like a taco. That's pretty true. Amq also did a recorder solo. Well, there you go. Wait, Amq, did you want me to do another? Do I need to play another song? Is that what you're saying? Hot dog is a taco. It sounds like we all just, like, had an epiphany at the same time. We're like, hot dogs are tacos. I don't know. I'm not walking. Excuse me, waiter, there's an oil spill in my soup. Oh, my God. Yes, I want another. I'm selfish. Okay, let me actually. Also, I need to turn the sound back in on the game. Here, I'm back. It's me. I just hit myself in the face. <sighs> um, I don't know. I'm out of material. I can play this one. Here we go. Um, except for I don't know. I don't know if I remember the ending on how to play this song. Oh, you want Twinkle Twinkle? Bet. If you give me if you give me recommendations, done. Angel, too good for this world. All right, here we go. I have Twinkle Twinkle Little Star ready. <laughs> Immediately just squeaks. Okay. Ow. Okay. finish isn't abc's just twinkle twinkle little star it is tim sell art hello welcome in thank you for being here for my um <laughs> for my recorder solo oh no oh my goodness tim sell art i have a question for you too if you're still here do you pirates of the caribbean oh my gosh i need to find i have the titanic theme song voice i do know the titanic theme song um but uh, Pirates of the Caribbean, I used to be able to play on my clarinet. We should definitely figure it out. Um, Tim Sell Art, do you know what happened to Liz T? I miss her. Do you know where she is? Is she just taking an elongated break for the holidays? Or is she coming back? I miss her very much. Baba Black Sheep. We have talked about Baba Black Sheep as well. Okay, hydrate. Mm-hmm. It is an all-time meme. I got those, like, sound thingies. Um, where people like give bits that you can, they'll play like sounds, 
But one of them is there, like everybody does like the Titanic recorder, and I'm like, why would I get the Titanic recorder when I can literally play it myself? <laughs> and the whole point is to it not to be good, so I'm it's perfect. Bogart, we just had like five recorder songs played. It was great. Pools or assassin soup? Oh my god. Oh yeah, she's just been like crazy busy with her promotion at work. Oh okay. Well, congrats to her for the promotion. That's amazing. I think I did know about that maybe, but that's great. That's super great. I was just worried. I've been so worried. I was like, I hope she comes back because I miss her. Did you see that midnight, midnight? ID? Oh, I didn't yet, Bogart. I'll have to check, take a look. Um, and like super stressed, etc. But I'm sure she'll be super happy to know you care. I'll be sure to pass along any thoughts. Thank you, Tim. Yeah, let her know. I can also reach out to her via Discord. But if you happen to talk to her, let her know that I do miss her and her content. Because she is a gem. She's so amazing. Um, all right, Penny is still at eight. We're leaving. Is Midnight even here? I think so. To be as supportive as I can. You're like, Liz, I miss you so much. <laughs> How do I say come back without saying come back? 75, 7.5K points to sell Murphy or Finch. Not in real life. Voice in the game. We're not selling the, the animals in real life. My cats are priceless. You could never make me sell them. Never. I'm gonna attempt to lurk and finish my crocheting. Enjoy fam, uh, move. I was gonna say fam, lit, lit, fam, move. <laughs> Enjoy your crocheting. Have a good night. Enjoy your lurk. Um, thank you for being here though. Mm -mm -mm. But how many pets in game? How many do I have? Well, I have a lot of farm animals. Okay, I want to go to the ocean. Or the, um, maybe I should wait to go to the island tomorrow, actually. So I can get a new quest. I don't do this Keys Cuisine, because I don't want to. But I should make more kegs. Let's go see if I have that capability. Let's go see. I feel like I came to town for a purpose. Did I even do anything here? I don't remember. Everything's blurring together. Honestly. Honestly. And my nose is just... Okay. Whoa. Oh, wait. Here first. I also need to make one of these... I think I just should make one of these obelisks. Okay. Tom Kai Soup. I'm whispering to myself. Tom cut soup. Tom cut soup. Tom cut soup. What does it look like? Here. I think I have all those things. Somewhere. Uh, shell? No, nope. Here. And a mushroom. Do I not have any common mushrooms? You're joking. You're joking. Do I really not? Wait. Here. Ha 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 ha. That scared me. I was like, well. Well, I guess fall would be right around the corner, so it wouldn't be that big of a deal. Let's take these out. And we're getting closer. Shells. Let's just sell the trash. Um, we're getting closer to wait, 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 wait. Where is it? I need to make these two. Oh, that's all we need to make. Remember? Because I almost cried that day. I figured out that eels are not in summer. Like, I thought someone told me they were. I think that is the best description for it. Wait, what? You can meet Pennywise? Do you have a mods list? Yes. Respect the eggs. Thank you so much, Patchy, for sharing the mods list. They're all there. Those are the ones that... there. I need to add a few of them. Respect eggs. But for the most part, those are most of the mods that I use. I just need to update a few. But thanks, Patchy. You guys are the best. This conversation was truly spectacular, but it leaves one question. What are the polar ice caps? The polar ice caps? No idea. <laughs> I don't think I fully know what's being talked about anymore. There wasn't an eel at the cart or anything, right? I'm going to go back and creep. Going back. Going back because gaming, but I'm sure Liz would love to hear from you. We're always chatting, but she loves surprises. Okay. I will definitely reach out to her then. Because I was just, 
I think I still have her on like my recommended streamers on my channel because I love her. And I was thinking about her the other day because I was playing some Journey King on my on my own uh, Journey of the Prairie King. And I was like, I wonder if she ever beat it on stream. I think I missed it if she did. And I was like, where has she been? I miss her so much. I enjoyed playing Fall Guys when she was doing that too. That was super fun. So hopefully when things calm down and she knows it's okay, it'll be good. Journey King trauma. I know. I will never forget about the time when she got to Vector, Vector, sorry, and was like, can I grab this heart down here? And she went for it and then died immediately. I, that was so sad. I was like, I cried. I literally have like screamed watching her play Vector. I just think it's so wild. I, like she was so close to beating him once and when she died, I literally was like screaming. Oh, I know the pain, I know the pain. But yeah, she's amazing. And the Fall Guys streams were very fun. Maybe I'll just do Fall, I'll, maybe I'll do some Fall Guys here in her honor someday. <laughs> we did talk about doing it. I did think about doing some Jackbox games or something tonight, cause I was like, it'll be like Christmas. Um, but I only own one Jackbox pack, so. And we played them last time. I laughed so hard, cackling. <laughs> It was so sad, but to rub it in her face, I beat Prairie King out of spite. Oh my gosh, I have also beaten Prairie King, so we just kind of seem like jerks. Frozen Soup made years ago and is supposedly going bad slowly? What? What is that voice? I'm so surprised that America has basically every climate ever. I guess we do, yeah. Perhaps an extravagant garnish for said soup. Oh goodness. Oh my goodness. Garnish always makes me just think of very, very fancy food. I know it's not. I know a garnish can be with anything, but that's what it feels like. I was going to make kegs. Stay focused, you little pea brain. Um, here. Here. I can make 17. Yeah, okay. Put it on the pizza. I need more wood. Always the wood. Let's also make more of these. Just to be safe. Just to keep the grind going. Oh. Oh. She everywhere. She's everywhere. All at once. Okay. Okay. Now the goal tomorrow is to go to the island. We gotta go to the island and check our, our percentage. DDTTW. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Hope you're having a great night. Now we're pro gamers. Yeah, because we beat Prairie King. I never thought I was going to beat it. Ever. And when I did beat it, I literally was like screaming and running around my apartment. It was great. If you don't have all of the Jackboxes, I'm pretty sure you can add the ones you don't have to your throne list if you want. They are among some of the game keys you can get. Oh, thank you, operator. I should, I should definitely do that. I have that throne list, but I always feel, I don't know. I always feel so stingy about those sort of things. You know what I mean? Like, I appreciate support and like... People sending things but I always feel so stingy I don't know my friend was like you should get one because I want to send you something if you add it and I was like okay and then when I put it in my description I was like it just feels so weird I don't know I'm dramatic I'm, I'm utilizing all the space that I possibly can here and making it look so ugly you can sit there here 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 um oh here yeah i can still get through here all right all right all right greenhouse oh wait i grabbed way too many okay these will be a day off of the other ones but that's all right that's all right as long as we got the wine brewing groovy groovy all good. My nose, it's just so bad. Or maybe the polar caps are just evidence of the soups not connected. Please lied. I'm so confused. I feel like I'm out of this conversation now. Let me not even try to pretend I know what's going on. Bravo, truly, we have solved life's mysteries. Oh, God. Let me not even try. What am I doing? Let me open up. <clears throat> Let's see. Don't freak out. The stream freaks out, but we don't. And... Let me see. Malzy starting farm. Okay, we made the Tom Kai soup. 
and we made the rhubarb. I have a Google Doc, just so you all know. For those of you who don't know, I have a Google Doc that helps me with um, keep track of things. Okay, we got the dwarf to 100, or to 100, <laughs> to 10 hearts. We got Sandy to 7. Let me just update this. 7 out of 10. And we got Penny to, I believe, 6 out of 8. Um, okay, we need to make some iridium bars, it looks like, because if we're going to get any of the obelisks, um, we need iridium bars out the butt. I think ancient fruit we finished for perfection. Okay. Okay. I'm losing my mind here. Okay. Groovy. Groovy, groovy, groovy. Tim, enjoy your enjoy your quiet and lurk. Thank you for being here. So good to see you. Um I thought I would never see Jimmy here on my Twitter timeline or whatever the Jimmy here is a famous for it's Wednesday, my dudes, and I believe he streams. Oh really? It's Wednesday, my dudes. Is he the one in the costume and then he just is like, huh? Ah! I think so. I okay, why I stopped watching him. Maybe it wasn't my type of humor. Maybe. Sometimes that happens. FYI. Is it really? I don't know why. I do that randomly, but I don't I have no idea why. That's interesting. I did not know that. And now I do. I'm smarter by one thing. Oh, I was going to make iridium bars. What am I doing in town? Oh, wait. I can't make iridium bars. Yes, I can. Maybe. If the furnaces are done. Hey, Molly. Hope you have a good Christmas tomorrow. It's the 24th here. Merry Christmas, Molly, in chat. Merry Christmas, Tapu Rose. Thank you so much. I hope you have, I hope you have an amazing Christmas and enjoy time with your loved ones and eat some good food, get some good gifts. But thank you so much for dropping in and, and saying something so sweet. Yeah, he wears a Spider-Man costume and Wolverine. Yeah, that's okay. That's why I'm thinking of the right thing. Okay, sweet. These are done. I'm literally just running around with my head, like a chicken with my head cut off right now. There's so much to do. You get nothing to do. Too blessed to be stressed. Okay. Uh, oh, I have so much radium. Boink, 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 boink. All right. We're grinding. We're grinding it out. That sounds horrible. Ah! <laughs> Okay. And now we sell these things. Hello? Oh, there's, I think a cat is at my door. Mother, let me in, mother. I just realized that it's technically Christmas Eve right now. I got a lot of stuff to get finished today. Move, go get your stuff finished. Go do what you gotta do. Hopefully you don't have to do any like last minute Christmas shopping because that sucks. Always sucks. Just hiss, exactly. Hiss. Oh, like, like that. Uh, it's just how I laugh. I just kind of, oh, his laugh. No, he like wheezes. Oh, gosh. Yeah, and his hair is long. Yeah, I know what you're talking about, Bogart. We're on the same page. What am I doing? Running in a circle now. Okay, I'm going home. I'm going home. I'm going to grab a gift for Sebastian first for the morning. Sick. Goodbye. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye. Sebastian, why are you standing over here like this? With your hair all damp like that from the rain, you're looking pretty hot. <laughs> Tonight, you thinking what I'm thinking. Oh, my God. I kissed him. <laughs> yeah, who wouldn't want to get down and dirty with this? Oh, no. Let me just change back into my other clothes. I'm too enticing this way. <laughs> I don't even know what to think. Okay. <laughs> Here I go. Oh, geez Louise. Are my boots still white? I don't think so. Gotta put my little white go-go boots back on. That's not right. That's not right either. Wait, where are they? Ah, oh, I look barefoot. I kind of love that. Oh, my feet are non-existent now. What happened to my feet? Wait, what happened to my white boots? What happened to my white boots? Blue? Brown? Brown? 
black, pink. Those pinks are kind of cute. Red, black, blue. That's not what they looked like. I'm just kind of fuzzled. <laughs> my feet don't exist. I literally don't know what happened to my shoes. Or maybe these were them. <laughs> Am I stupid? Moved in it to find, oh, to finish crocheting a blanket and a scarf. And when it's successful of being awake hours, I got to cook for the potluck. Ooh, that sounds so nice. A potluck? That sounds so cozy. But I get that. Definitely wait till acceptable hours. But hopefully it's not too much to clean. I mean, to cook, I guess I should say. Here they are. Ha 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 ha. Okay. Oh, jeez, Louise. I'm going to bed. I'm out. I'm out. But that's exciting, too, that it goes towards, um crocheting as well happy holidays molly i got a couple streamers to stop by and i need to get water but i'll be back no worries tree bard oh my god it's so good to see you i feel like i haven't seen you in forever but hello happy holidays to you as well all right on to the monday on to monday hello son <laughs> that was rude child a baby why did that do that Sorry. Yeah, just doing finger food so it won't be too bad. Ooh, finger food's fun though. What kind of stuff are you gonna make? Finger food always makes me think of pig pigs in a blanket. That's what I always think of, is that meal, which I haven't had in forever. I used to be obsessed with those little, like, little hot dogs though. <laughs> Cocktail weenies, is that what they're called? Cocktail weenies. Not me clipping something relatable. What are we doing? Are you, do you mean clipping something in another stream that's relatable? Honestly, I don't think anything in here was relatable, was it? Never. I'm not relatable at all. I'm secretly a vampire. I'm not relatable. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Making those and sausage balls and cocktail weenies and a few other things. Oh my god, that sounds so good. Can I be invited? Please invite me. <laughs> no, I'm watching. I'm not watching anyone else. So you clipped me? What did I do that was possibly relatable? I don't even know what I was talking about. I was talking about cocktail weenies. <laughs> uh, do you ever just imagine people coming in at like random times in your stream and that's what they hear? Like they just come in and I was like, all I was talking about is cocktail weenies. And that's your first impression of somebody? Golden. I know I'd stay forever. But I have to stay forever. It's literally my stream. I'm here all the time. <laughs> Tess, Sarah, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Welcome in, welcome in. I hope you're having a great night. And yo, yeah, in Clips channel, don't look. It's just for myself. Oh gosh. I don't even, I don't, I don't know if I want to know what I did. I don't even know. This or something else. Hello, look at your cute little cat emote. How are you doing? Welcome in. Uh, no, I, oh wait, because no one else is live. That's why you're watching me? Not because you love me? Just because nobody else is live? I understand. I'm not actually... Oh, that's sad. I understand. <laughs> just saying. I'm just giving you a hard time. I thought what we had was special. I think I should check out the slimes. I think it's time. Okay, wait. Hey, IDK, where you are, but if you want to drive to nowhere, Mississippi, then you're welcome to come. That sounds nice. I'd probably hit a lot of snow on the way there and some sketchy weather conditions. But hey, maybe I can make it in, in two days. Maybe two and a half, hopefully, so I can make it in time for all the good food. I live in California. How long of a drive is it here? I'm, for, I'm here for the epic gaming. Thanks, Tim. <laughs> Thank you very much. I know I'm such an epic gamer. It's so good. I'm good, your mods are so pretty. Oh, thank you. I know, mods really are a game changer. Test you, do you use mods if you do play Stardew? Are you a big mod fan? Some people are not, so I just, I like to ask. Okay, yet another ponder question unanswered. If we are simple seasoning to this great soup, the world is no soup, just broth for another dinner in the continent. Wait. Continents? Patchy, what is happening? I think I missed the whole conversation about like what this was really about. 
So every time I try to jump into it now, I just feel so stumped. I'm just too stumped. I missed this whole soup food discussion. I was messing around with my buds earlier and the best idea happened that they were like, next time you stream, just speak only in the heavy Minnesotan accent and don't even acknowledge it's happening. Amgu, yes. I would live for that. I love doing a um, Minnesotan accent. Minnesotan. My, um, I think I told the story once how my old boyfriend pointed out I have slight Minnesotan like isms in my speech that I just got from my parents because they're from Minnesota. Tim Sil Art, thank you for resubscribing for another month, by the way. And thank you for the head pats <laughs> on my little head. Um, you're amazing. And I'm so glad you came in tonight just so I could annoy you about list tea, but also because I love seeing you. So thank you so much. I appreciate you. Oh my gosh. I'm here to question the world. <laughs> I believe you, Patchy. It's great. I'm not watching slash working in anyone else's stream because no one else is live and that's fine because I love you so much. I love you too, Bogart. Thank you. <laughs> I'm glad I could be live then, giving you some content. And then we all start doing the don't you know, don't you know. Um, it's funny because I remember somebody saying that to me. They were like, oh, they always say don't you know. And I was like, it's, it's not even like, don't you know is kind of like my really thick Minnesotan relatives do that. Like who have like the really thick accents. I always hear that. But it's yeah. A lot of people go yeah, yeah, oh yeah. Like they do that all the time. And that's the biggest Minnesotan thing I've noticed when like I had some friends come and stay from Minnesota. Just the whole time this girl, my like basically my cousin was just sitting there like, oh yeah, yeah. Like after everything. So when she left, I started doing it and I was like this is bad this is bad now I just sound like a loser and everyone's like you're from Colorado why you sound like that cuz us Coloradans we don't really have accents we just say things like how they're spelled and then everyone's like but we don't say our T's I've talked about this before on stream but the really everyone's like we don't say our T's though that's our little quirky quirk and I'm like I feel like a lot of people don't say their teas. Like, I don't see, hear a lot of people go, water. Would you like some water? Mmm. Unless you're trying super hard with addiction. I mean, maybe people do, and I'm just being a little dumb baby, but I feel like I don't hear that very often. <laughs> I feel like I don't. I play Stardew, but I've never tried mods. I'm tempted, though. You should, Tess, you should totally try them out. You should totally try them out. They're amazing. Um, as long as you have, like, a PC or something. Because I couldn't get them to work on Mac. That's the only reason. I don't know. Lord, it's way too cold down here. Mississippi is not supposed to get negative 10s. Oh, gosh. I know somebody, Victor was saying he lives in Wisconsin and that it's negative temps there. But not that those are even remotely close to each other. But I'm just saying, like, different places right now are definitely experiencing the, the negative temps. Philosophical rabbit hole. Don't worry about me. I believe you, Patchy. We'll just read all your thoughts and it's great. Is the ya yeah, ya yeah thing German or Dutch? I feel like it might be German because my family is German and they're from Minnesota. So who knows? <laughs> okay, bye now. Yep, yep, bye. Yep, bye now. Have you seen those TikToks, Sam Gu, where the guy's like Minnesotan hospitality and he's he'll like hold doors open and then they're just like, oh, what are you doing? And he's like, oh, I'm just I'm I'm waiting for that guy down the down the road. And then they're like, what? He's like, oh yeah, he'll be here any minute. I'm just holding the door open for him. <laughs> my Minnesotan accent is so bad so sorry but he's like it's just supposed to be like a joke about how Minnesotan people are just so so nice and then me and Curtin were talking about the the Midwestern goodbye where you like make it seem like you're the person annoying them like oh oh I'll get out of your hair now you know like oh well I don't want to take up any more of your time and then they'll like leave and in reality it's like I would like you to go, but I'm gonna make it seem like it's my fault. <laughs> oh gosh, Stardew Expanded is probably one of my favorite mods. It's, it adds a lot to the game, and it's like experience if you get tired of the base game. Yeah, Move, I really need to play Expanded. That's been on my radar for quite a while. Um, but I, I've beaten, I've done completion on another file that I have, but I'm trying to get completion on this one because it's our, our streaming file. Um, so once we do that, I'm gonna, probably the next thing is to try out 
mods on stream like some different mods i've been interested in and we can all like see them together but also to do expanded as a tim i'm offended by the t omission yeah i just call you m i never call you tim i just say m baku goes in the middle of my skip button replacing the t's with d's is pretty common i think i know water i i don't say mountains though i i think i do say like mountains i that's the one i do say i'm like mountains i don't do mountains That's true voice. That's that is how it started. Yeah, see so you don't say teas. Also, MQ, thank you for the hydrate. My nose is just so bad, guys. I think I have cat hair on me. I say mate. I feel Australian for some reason. Might. Yeah, it's pretty it's pretty Australian. Pretty Australian. Pronouncing T is fine. What about pronouncing the huh and what? Well hut? Is that what you mean? Well hut? <laughs> Reminds me of um working at a Jewish school because you don't know I work in a Jewish school I teach I help teach kindergarten and first grade and there's a lot of there's a few kids who um, have ch like in their name because usually it's like a ch if you're meant to do like the ch and the other day I was like I was telling them I'm like well this is our last day together before Hanukkah break and I did the ch and all these little girls like lost their minds they were just like you're the only English teacher because they have like Judaic teachers and then English teachers. They're like, you're the only English teacher who actually does the huh. And like, they were so excited. And I was like, that's precious. <laughs> I was like, that's pretty precious. I'm so tired of getting the same two. I don't want to do this one. I'll do the gifts again. Ugh. Fine. One. One gem. We're at 84%. Is that different than what I had already? I had 83% written down last time. Now we're at 84. Get on my level. Oh, golly gee whiz. Okay. <laughs> the hun, what? Yes, the holding the doors open for people is a typical goodbye. I love it. Okay, now let's just get Adelie now. <laughs> that is so cute. Expanded has new pretty romance. It does. Sophia's cute. I want to romance Sophia. Y'all said Australian, and now I want to watch Bluey. <gasps> I wish Curtin was still here. Curtin and I have been talking about Bluey so much lately. I love Bluey. My niece watches that. Less hum or a ch. <laughs> Not ha. Ch. 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 <laughs> I don't know what I'm trying to say. They think you're pretty precious too. Oh, voice. Did you know? Do you know that for sure? No fooling. Yeah, the girls I work with are pretty precious. Yeah, we have the first grade girls and then their um, co-ed in kindergarten because that's just how it's set up. But they're all pretty precious. All pretty precious. They were definitely excited to go on break. So a few of them went to Israel for break. A, few, a lot of them are also going to New York. And then there's a lot of them also going to New Jersey. And then there's me. I'm just here. But like I said, I'm going home to uh, Colorado in um, January. That was another thing earlier. Propel said earlier they were like everybody say Colorado and like say how you say it and I get made fun of all the time in in California by the way I say Colorado apparently a lot of people say Colorado it just doesn't seem right do you say bag or bag I say bag I say bag big big <laughs> sorry now I can't stop saying it. Yeah, I say bag. But I have a lot of, like, O's. Like, instead of phone, a lot of the time it comes out, like, phone. That was the first time I ever noticed it when my ex-boyfriend was like, you do the O sometimes. And I was like, oh, shoot. And my brothers do it, too. Both my brothers, I've noticed. Like, when we talk on Discord, I'm like, we all do it. Hilarious. Da data or data? I say data. I do say data. Yes. Data. This is a very interesting conversation, isn't it? It's kind of fun. It's the Canadian sor sorry. Am I saying that sorry? Less than five out of out of around eighty minimum. What? In some twelve years of regular school, I had less than five good teachers. So yes, I'm sure the simple kindness you show, they remember for life. Yeah, I like to think I'm pretty kind. I know I can get frustrated sometimes, but I stay pretty kind because 
I think I'm just a kind person. That's my MO, right? I'm a college student. I get my serotonin from Bluey and coffee. Exactly. As you should, Moof. As you should. Yeah, they think you're pre you're very precious. You can trust my word because I am... <laughs> All right, I do trust you, MQ. I do, I do trust you. <laughs> caramel or caramel? I say caramel. If I'm talking about, like, caramel on something, I say caramel. But if it's, like, oh, I, a caramel, like a candy, a caramel candy, I feel like I change. Sorry, but the O is always with the accent. <laughs> I want to hear your... MQ, I want to hear you do it. Okay, do you say caught or caught the same way or differently caught like oh you can sleep on the cot oh I caught that I say them the same I don't know how you'd say them differently how would you say them differently they've been having an issue where I ask patients for that their full name and they give me their phone number and I'm not sure how many because I've not even the same number of sil syllables oh my god full name phone number Oh my gosh. Does that happen all the time, Ava, you mean? There must be something happening. Not to brag, but I think I can do a pretty good Minnesotan accent. I feel like I can do a really good one when I'm not on stream and nervous. <laughs> Every time I do, like, accents on stream, like, I have a mean... But also, I think it's the, the, the fact that you're doing them in front of people like who are from those places right like I sit here and I go I have a pretty good Australian accent but then people from Australia are in your chat and they're listening to you do them and then I'm just embarrassed like I'm just like no 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 <laughs> from a from a um like a American standpoint my Australian accent's pretty good but from a uh Australian standpoint, no. It's awful. They're probably like, ugh. Ugh. No, thank you. We have an old argument in my linguistics class about caught and caught. Really? Amigo, I do really want to um, hear you do a Minnesotan accent, though. I'd love to hear it. Not quite. Oh, my God. I think I got the hair. It was on the center of my nose for quite a while, too. <laughs> oh, my gosh. We had a whole... Wait. Taught, taught, taught. See? I would say those all the same. See, I'm born and raised here, so I'm going to meme the crap out of the accent. Exactly, as you should. I just say, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, don't you know? I did that during an improv show. Somebody was like, I want to hear... We did, like, a little segment where I was a camp counselor. And I had my... I, like, walked around, like, with a fake clipboard and was trying to run a camp. And I did a Minnesotan accent, and it killed... And I was like, thanks. And my one of the guys who was the TA, he's like, I never knew you could do so many different accents. Like, where have you been hiding those all, all semester? And I was like, I, it's like when I sing in front of people, I go tone deaf. When I try to do accents in front of people, I just lose them. Like, I just lose them all. I swear that'll be the last time I'll leave for the stream. Are we still talking about accents? We are, Bogart. We are. Um, and my horribleness at accents. Next time I stream tomorrow, I'll do the accent for the whole stream. Oh my gosh, MQ, I'll make sure to stop in though. Well, hopefully I'll be able to stop in. My partner and I are going to be spending the day together for our anniversary. But when I have downtime, I'll definitely try to stop in. Boop, 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 boop. Come back. Okay, so I need to give some gifts. Is Trevor playing something out there? I swear I just heard him talking. Am I crazy? He might be playing Fortnite. Fortnite. Uh-oh, I have more hair on my nose. Somebody send help. Crafting. Shells? Do I not? Maybe. Oh, wow. I have iridium sea urchin. Good for me. <laughs> Good for me. Shipping bin. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 Um, yep. Yep. Bogart, we're still memeing about the accents. We are. We are. Um, the most Midwestern thing I can do is the ya, yeah, no, ya. Yeah. No, ya, yeah, no, ya. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, no, ya. Yeah. We do that a lot, Ayla. <laughs> you know, he's like, I can confirm. I can confirm that the no, ya, yeah, no is, uh, is, uh, pretty real. Yeah, I just do the O's. That's about it. My, um, I had an old best friend who was from New Jersey, and... I remember visiting her and her whole family just thought it was so fun to ask me to say things because I don't say anything weird. Like, that's the thing about Coloradans. Like, 
we don't say anything weird. We just say everything as it's it's spelled, basically. So people love to like make you say things. Cause at, she had a Jersey accent. Like her mom had like a genuine thick Jersey accent. And so she loved to hear me say things. I was like, this is hilarious. And I was told that when I did like a short film when I got to California, everybody was like, you speak. Like the way you speak is so nice. And I'm like, I don't think that's true. And when I, I talk really fast, like I know I do. Um, but when I'm performing, I've been told I have really nice pronunciation because I used to not have good pronunciation when I performed and then I got really in my head about it. So I like drilled it super hard and then I did Shakespeare. So now it's like when I perform, I make sure pronunciation is like a really big thing for me. Um, but I felt like that was such a nice compliment there where they were like, you just, you speak so nicely. Like, I love the way you, you enunciate and do all that. And I was just kind of like, okay, <laughs> that's good. Thank you. I've never had somebody ever say that to me. The Patchy, Patchy is straight up still going through life for changing revelations. I know Patchy's, Patchy's having epiphanies tonight. Roof or, are you trying to say roof or roof? I say roof. Roof. Get off the roof. The questions the universe might have answers or perhaps they merely appear to and I must find them. <laughs> Patchy's like, I must find them and it must be here and now. Hey, Patchy might discover something amazing and we're all witnesses. We're all witnessing. Oh, I never saw the... <gasps> Look how cute the playground looks with this mod on. Adorable. So stinking cute. The answer is 42, Patchy. Don't even worry about it. <laughs> the answer is 42. The limit does not exist. The limit does not exist. Ohio is like that. I have very little accent and I have a really easy time talking to automated systems. Oh my gosh. Ayla, I believe that because my stepmom and stepsister are from uh, Ohio and they definitely like did never have accents. Like they definitely talk a lot like I do. Does Ohio still really exist out there? Oh my gosh. Oh, when I was little, I had good pronunciation. All my teachers would ask me if I was from the North. The deep Southern accent came later. <laughs> now they'd meet you and they'd be like, what happened to you? Oh God. That's a funny thing to think about. Okay. Let's get the scroll in bed. Now I'm just wandering around trying to make, waiting for things to finish. All right, to sleep I go. There's more hair on my nose and my nose is just so stinking bad. Oh my spaghetti pie. Molly teaches English. Does Shakespeare on stage, plays the recorder and is funny. Leaves some for the rest of us. You're funny voice. You're funny. As I like sit here just like itching the crap out of my nose. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay. Here's the skippy guys. I think I'm going to end stream there because I know that it's Christmas Eve for a lot of you and I don't want to keep taking up your time. Also, I just realized voice that you said I'm, I'm funny. Thank you so much. <laughs> that means a lot to me. I love being told I'm funny. It's pretty, honestly the biggest compliment there ever is. Um, but I know it's Christmas Eve for a lot of you or just the holidays. So I'm going to let you guys go enjoy your time and get some good sleep. And I'm going to go watch a Christmas movie, I think. Um, and get ready to get up early because um, Tim the Milkman and I are going to go enjoy ourselves for a nice little day together. We're going to go down to the beach. We're going to have a good night and good dinner. So thank you, Move, for the follow. You're amazing. You're amazing. Um, look at the cute little – look at the Junimos. Aren't they so cute? I just changed that. I need to move it over a little bit. But I love you guys so much. I hope everyone had a good night and a happy holidays. I know. I hope you have a great, great night. I was thinking about raiding somebody, but I know that we all need to get out of here too. Um, I was trying to see if there's anybody maybe we just know and love that's comfy, cozy. Somebody new, but also somebody tried and true. I feel like it's a lot of um, bigger streamers who I know who are currently doing um, streams. So maybe I shouldn't. Maybe we should just go and enjoy our nights. Raids are overrated. I dip when whoever you, <laughs> when you whoever raided you. Oh, really? You don't like raids? I know, voice. I thought you were just going to leave and be gone. I was like, oh, okay. All right. Well, then in that case, I think I'll just let you guys go enjoy your holidays. And when I'll be back on um, the 26th, I need to figure out the time because I do have to bring Trevor to the airport. So we will figure it out. Do you know of Nellie and Grits? No, Nellie and Grits. I'm trying to copy this name. What is who's Nellie and Grits? 
Oh my spaghetti pie. Um, Amgu, I don't, but I will save their page so that we can we can read them another time. We should do that. Um, is G Gacho? Sorry, now I'm just curious who all these folks are that you guys are sending over. I want to see. I might save some friends and then we can. Um, what is he playing? Are they playing? Oh, whoa. Oh, no. He has two. I'm not rating him. He has 34K followers. That's terrifying. No way. I don't do that. Those kind of streams scare me. <laughs> not like they're bad, but like he's, he's like godly and then I'm here in my Snoopy sweatshirt. You know what I mean? <laughs> no, I can't. I can't. I'm too nervous. Okay. Okay. I'm saving some of these people who you guys are saying to raid and I think we'll raid them um, next time because I'm going to let you go enjoy your holiday and I'm going to go um, force Trevor to watch a Christmas movie with me and wash my nose because I have cat hair on me so i love you all happy holidays have a, if you celebrate christmas have a great christmas if you celebrate hanukkah or any of the other holidays kwanzaa i don't know what the what the setup is and how the holidays work but i love you all enjoy time with your family or with your loved ones or eating good food opening good presents um watching good streams taking care of yourself but i will see you again on monday and we'll keep our lovely vibe and community going but have a good night there is comfort where you know no it or not you can always have the chance to find something new and enjoyable exactly hope you feel much better thank you i'm gonna go blow my nose and get some good sleep probably but i love you all have a good night i'm finally leaving okay goodbye happy holidays goodbye <laughs>